Hello, hello, hello. I hope my voice isn't too loud. I hope it's not too quiet either. I hope all the audio is okay, actually. Let me give this a good minute or two to actually get going. Change the title. This is the old title. One second, guys. I'm going to change the title. I think that should be good. I changed the title, because this game is super long. Um, yes, it is me, the Lone Ranger. He, everyone's favorite VGC player who never plays VGC. We're playing Dragon Quest XI again, because I love this game so much and I really want to just play it. <laughs> I could play this game all day. One thing, I actually did play it a little bit yesterday. You could, if you did watch. Well, first of all, let's get caught up story-wise. Thank you, Grandpa. Lone Ranger and his band of brave companions finally arrive at the Fortress of Fear to do battle with the Lord of Shadows. Though the Spectral Sentinel Indignus, aka Nocturnus, I'm almost certain that Nocturnus is in the game because Indignus is actually Nocturnus, but different. Like, right? He's the same model as Nocturnus. So I would be surprised if Nocturnus is in post-game somewhere. But that, that's beyond the point. Spectral Sentinel Indignus attempts to bar their path. He is no match for their combined might, and the party makes short work of him before making their way inside. So yes, we're at the quote-unquote final dungeon. I, th I think the game wants you to believe it's the final dungeon, but I don't think it is because of three things. And it's like three things from the same spot, right? Uh, when we went to Galopolis, this is a huge dungeon. But yeah, when we went to Galopolis, um, and Erdwin's Lantern was falling, we there was the little nuggets, there was the fact that there was the writing on the, the Erdwin's Lantern that said what, um, what, what did it say? It said something. I can't remember. It's, it's so, sell. So, it started with a C. Cosmaltos, wasn't that it? It said like Cosmaltos. And I want to I want to mount you. Yeah, so we don't know what Cosmaltos means. We don't know what those little nuggets are doing. And <clears throat> we don't know why um Mortigon wanted to destroy the star. So I should also mention that uh I did some grinding yesterday off stream because I didn't think you guys wanted to watch me grind. It was pretty boring. I was just like doing quests for money and stuff. But we got a lot of new equipment which I, as soon as I finish up this battle I will show you just how powerful my guys are. Uh, we also got some uh, we also gained some levels so our, our party is now level um we're now level 48 now as well. So not like a ton more powerful, but hold on. Let me show you this. Oh, that is not the right button. Uh, here we go. So main character now has the Metal Great Sword plus three. 
Liquid Metal Helm, Liquid me and the Liquid Metal Armor, and we got the Wings of Serendipity up to plus three as well. So Vanda now has the Fire Blade, uh, Liquid Metal Helm, and Liquid Metal Armor. Rab has the Sacrosanct Staff plus three, and we moved uh, Sylvanda's, who was had originally had the Twinkling Tuxedo plus three, we moved that onto uh, our old man right here. And then we got the costume for Serena. Uh, we got the I got the Saintess dress. I also got the Goddess Tiara and Saintess dress to plus three, and I got her Ethereal shield to plus three as well. So, and then like we moved Rab's Macabre mantle to Jade. And I think that's I think that's it. We also got a Hades helm for uh, for Hendrik and stuff like that. But th those guys are in the back, so they don't get pampered. They just get the hand me downs. But yeah, basically, I went out to to get the Saint Test dress for Serena, and I ended up getting a bunch of um. Hey, what's going on, Insidium? I ended up getting a bunch of um recipe books, and I'm like, oh, these are some pretty good. These are some pretty good armor and weapons we can make, so I, I ended up grinding a lot instead of just a little. So yes, we're here at the Fortress of Fear. And we've got to get the treasure first. Because treasure is more important. Oh, another recipe book. Pride of the Valkyries. Warrior princesses headdresses and regular dresses. Hold on. I want to I want to look at those things. Can we make those things? Fun size forge. A hat. A warrior princess. Oh, maybe it's a Is it a helmet? Yeah, it counts as a helmet. Uh, it's only something for Jade. It costs one gold bar, two savvy sapphires, two brighten rocks, and two grass grits. That's honestly not too difficult to make. Um, oh, I guess it's closed for this. Where is it? There it is. Warrior's Princess Dress. One Technicolor Dream Cloth, two Artiful Amethyst, three Slipweeds, and one Sainted Soma. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make those because I'm not pampering to Jade. I'm not wasting my items on her. Ha ha ha. No, I mean that like that's the reason why I I want to keep my items. But, but it, they might be they might be good. Uh, I'll check them out the next time. Oh, I got a liquid metal jacket. Ooh, who who can be equipped with that? Lone can. It actually does not. It gives you decent defense, but it l raises your evasion chance by 6%. But did this help Rab? Can he even be equipped with it? Yes. But he loses 5 defense. And he loses all his charm. Oh, he would be the most uncharming person in the game. Alright, which one of you guys is going to get it? I guess you then, right? Let's push you from 173 to 176. Or we could give it to you. I might actually give it to Jade then. Or we could give it to you. It, it would help you by four. It would help you by three. And it would help you by four. It also helps your evasion chips. Well, what if this... It would lower his charm. Wow, look how charming Hendrik is. I didn't even realize that. He's got almost 350 charm. That's crazy. Um, I guess, I guess I'll give it to, um, Jade, because it does nothing but help Jade, and Jade's stats. Not a bad, not a bad item at all, honestly, it's just that nobody can really benefit from it. Oh, fun. Oh, fun, a Pandora's box, yes, this is definitely what I came up with. Man, give me a real treasure next time. Alright, you know what, it do not matter, wait, that really does matter, please don't KO. Aw, oh, nice. He only missed. Okay, now we can't use magic. That's on Fort. But we can use magic that affects ourselves. So we're going to full up. Oh, another thing I should mention is that I did unlock some new skills while I was grinding. So we got this, uh... 
we got this new, um, basically a new version of Cutting Edge called Unbridled Blade. Yeah, as you can see, <laughs> so much more powerful than uh, the regular Cutting Edge. We can't use magic, so we just gotta kind of swing our sticks. Oh, don't don't steal my MP, boo boo. Get out of here. I I just want you to go down, so I'm just gonna use Unbridled Blade again. <laughs> that is so strong. Ooh, I'm liking this ability. Oh, nice, and we get that seed of skill. All right, I might use that right now. Who needs it the most? Oh, uh, really nobody. I'll use it when somebody's like one point away from getting a new skill, and I don't want to wait. Oh, there's pots over there. Could be a mini metal. Can't risk skipping it. I bet you it is a mini metal. There's no way. Bam. Oh, no. It's a colorful cocoon. Okay. That's not bad. I I'm happy to get one of those. Oh, what is this thing? Bam. A golden girl. Oh, we, we don't get to uh, boost our attack first. It's still... It died in one hit! Yo. I'm gonna heal up real quick as well. Alright, down here is really nothing. Is this, uh... Not that way. This way. Oh my goodness. Okay, that door is not locked. A manticore. Ow. Alright, let's oomph up alone. This is pretty much the strategy. Just boost Lone Ranger's attack, the main character's attack, and then just hit him with this super powerful ability. <laughs> and basically knock out anything in one hit. Especially with this sword. Like, this is one of the best swords I can get up to this point. Ooh, a nice ethereal stone. Not gonna go there quite yet. We're actually gonna go this way. What is going on down here? Oh my goodness. The King Cure Slime. And he brought the goons! Alright, so Vando's getting pepped up. You know what that means. The lugger demands. They gotta go. We're gonna evaporate these goons real quick. And now we're going to hit this guy up. The King Cure Slime. Died in one hit. Hendrick gains a level. Now he has 16. Can't that get me a new thing? Yeah, these each cost 16. So what do I want? Double up, sacrifice the defense, hit no orders to a significantly increased attack, or Falcon Slash. Falcon Slash is really good. I'm going to get that first. What is this ability? Double Edge Slash. Oh, that's basically double edge. And then this is the ultimate heroism skill. A series of six unstoppable swings unleashed on a single enemy. We also have to get this to unlock this, and then we also have to get this and this and swords to unlock this for heroism. And I think there's a shield skill. Yeah, so we have to get this and this and great swords to unlock that shield skill. And that's also a sword skill, so we don't need to get that. The axe skills are really simple. Once we get axes of evil, we're, we're completely finished with axe skills. Great swords is also pretty simple, but but we already have great sword users, so I don't need you to be a great sword user. All right, we wiped out that guy and his goons. Now I can go this way. There's two manticores over here, but there's also a treasure chest. They've been alerted to my presence. I don't care. I'm taking this treasure. I don't care what it is. I want it. I need it. Three pieces of Technicolor Dream Cloth. All right. All right. We're getting a lot of good items in here, so maybe we can make some new stuff for Jade if we really want to. I'm gonna go this way. No, not that way. That's where we came from. This way leads outside. Oh, they're coming. I was just looking for treasure. Hold on. The whole... 
The whole squad's after me. Alright, let's see what the outside looks like. Oh, okay. There's just treasure over here. I found a chrono crystal. Alright, I'll take it. Alright, I guess we gotta go this way now. Alright, boo boo. You wanna die again? I'll beat you again. You're gonna need more than that. Okay, I could crack. I'll do a good amount of damage. But this will do more. We're running out of MP. I'm just going to attack, actually. We gotta save our MP. Except we don't really need to save it on a. I really feel like Zamble's gonna do nothing, because he probably resists his dark, but I'm gonna try it anyway. 81? Okay, that's not bad damage. It's not bad. We really need to learn Kazam on Rab, because Zamble is just not doing enough. Rab needs to gain a level and a new spell. And it grows to level 49. Now we have 10 skill points. I don't think that. Actually, I kind of want to start working my way downwards on he these so I can unlock this. Uh. Do I want the Guile skill first or the Knife skill? Probably the Knife skill. Or the Guile skill is what I meant. Actually, I'll, I'll see if I can do them at the same time. Because we need to unlock this and this as well. So we also need to unlock that. Alright, 20 of Eric's skill panels have been activated. Alright, I'm not going to unlock anything else just yet. Oh, what is this? Oh, is this going to like come crashing down? I'm going to step on this it's going to fall. An evil force is blocking the way. But what is that evil force? Oh my gosh, we just broke all the crystals. Okay, now we can travel up and down. And hey, we can travel left and right too. Yeah, they all know Kazam, come on. Come on, Grandpa, why don't you know Kazam? Oh no, I'm in hella chop, dude. We really shouldn't be blowing our PP like this. Or MP. This isn't this isn't Pokemon. It basically is Pokemon though. Alright, what is this? Platinum ore? Okay, I'll take it. Doesn't even look like there's anything over here. And that is because there isn't anything over here. LOL. Did that break the seal on the door below? No, it did not. That seal is still there. We're gonna need to break that seal eventually. Walk down the hallway, there's an eye on the wall. Oh, what was that? Is that a King Kier slime? Oh, everyone's after me. Look at these goons. No, stop, I didn't do anything. I'm innocent. Gooper can Oh, they're surrounding me. Ooh, smoothly dodged, okay. Oh, who is this? A group of enemies. Um, I'm gonna oomphal up long. Oh, 
Oh no, what is this? The dance of... Oh, he tried to curse us. Cooper Trooper. Caped Capers. I'm just gonna crack. Zamo's too weak for this point of the game. Alright, that actually knocked somebody out. And yeah, just attack. We gotta save that MP. And we're gonna crack with Serena as well. Bow. Could be. Solvando gains a level. Now he's got 17 skill points. That can definitely get us something. The question is what? A new sword skill? No, don't we need this over here? Right, we need to get this over here. So that we can unlock our final, uh, nice, 20 skill panels for him. This final liveness spell up here. Have a ball. Rain down juggling balls on enemies at random. Alright, that's not bad. Kind of expensive though for 20. What is this over here? That's just a plus 5 pep chance for 12. That's pretty cheap. I'll probably get that next then. It looks like it's cheaper than everything else, yeah. And all of Serena's skills are super expensive. Oh, another dude. Yeah, they're so ugly. A Hooper Trooper. I have to beat up the ugly dudes. Because they deserve it. Man, it's just so sad when you see the damage difference from Silvando to, uh, to Lone. Oh, nice crit, Rab. Great job. Because, <laughs> like, Savannah's supposed to be doing a decent amount of damage, and he just doesn't. To be fair, though, he's mostly on the team for buffing spells like Moonful. Just one man to court. You know what? Nah, I can fight you. Yeah, we mostly have him to Oomphal. And he also gets Accelerado, Remore Heal, and a bunch of fancy. Like, he's like the minstrel class, right? So he gets a lot of interesting... Um, no, not this again. Run! Oh no, I've been cursed. I don't know what that curse does. Well, no, I missed! Oh, garbage! Get your garbage out of here. Bang! There, now he's dead. Oh, well, that's what the curse does. It makes you randomly not able to move. Lovely. I'm gonna like swoosh this guy. Bow. Lots of damage. Smacked. Knocked him out. Okay, there we go. Yes. Suna is the most fantastic character in this game, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. We're gonna warp somewhere. Oh, here's some exoskeletons. That we can take over. More Hooper Troopers. Oh, they're still cursed! Oh, I didn't know curses carry over. Crap. I gotta knock out the ugly boy first. Luckily it didn't affect Rab just yet. Oh, still alive. Hard boiled exoskeleton, that's what they're called. Oh, he's blowing this place up. Oh, Lone's so low, holy crap. But don't worry, Kakrak should knock these guys out. Bang. Oh no, that guy's still alive. Oh, what is this? Ha! He missed everybody but Serena, and Serena lived on one. Alright, let's heal up. Alright, we can't jump that way. So it looks like we gotta go this way. Even claw. Nice. You'll never take me alive. <laughs> I'm too quick. We gotta find that red button. Oh, what is this goon? Get over here. Yeah, that's right. I shot you in the butt. 
What are you gonna do about it, Balib? What is this ugly boy? Here's what we're gonna do. Bow. Ouch. Aw, oh, you, you're gonna need to hit twice if you're gonna wanna beat us. Let's see how much Zamel does to this boy. 87. Yeah, that's like no damage. Bang. Aw, oh, come on, he's still alive? out of here. Dead. Pretty much alone is our only damage dealer. And it's so easy for him to deal damage too. It's like crazy easy for me to just oomphal him up and start clicking that super powerful attack and start KOing stuff. Unless I run out of MP. Where does this lead? This just leads to treasure. Hey, 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 hey. That's enough out of you. General directives. General's jackets and general jack boots. How do I make those? A general jacket is two technicolor dream class, three even class, two pitch pearls, and a finish test. We could actually make this for Hendrick, but I'm not going to, but we could. And then the boots, which is probably an accessory. General Jack Boots takes two Dragon Hides, a Gold Nugget, a Saint's Ashes, and two Even Cloths. Yeah, we could make that whole set. Well, I don't know if I want to. Well, we're going to fight this guy because I could not get away from him. But that is okay because he's no problem at all. Yeah, go ahead and attack. He's pretty low. This might knock him out. Oh, wow, I didn't. Okay, I was wrong. Now we gotta take a Kaswoosh. Wait, he doesn't have enough MP? Huh? How does he have Kaswoosh but can't use it? That doesn't. Well, good job, dude. Thanks for making my life easier. What is down there? That is where we came from, I think. But I can't really tell. Here's a big brute. All right, let's heal up. Smash. Jerkules. All right. Are you kidding me? He just... <laughs> Did he actually just flex on me? Oh, how disrespectful. There's a reason that missed. The only person who's allowed to flex here is yours truly. I invented the flex gang. Bang. One reason that um, Sylvando might not be doing that much damage is because it's possible that these guys resist fire and he has a weapon that does fire type damage every time it attacks. But it's his strongest choice. That's why I wanted it. Alright, I'll summon that power of the luminary again. Break these crystals. Oh, these enemies are getting more powerful, looks like. A Dread Dragooner. Alright, let's hope he's... Of course he knows Kazam because the only people who aren't allowed to know Kazam. Oh, he lowers Rab's attack. You know what? Fine. I'll show you. Oh my gosh. So sad. Come on, Rab. Just get Zan Kazam already. Alright, this should finish him off. Oh, nice critical hit. I don't even think we needed it, but nice crit. This is why we love Serena because she always at, she always needs to make sure that she did good, and she always does. She always does more than she's asked. We got another thing of Saint's ashes. This better not be a. Okay, nice two sainted somas. Ooh, that's really good. A 
and yeah, this is... I'm pretty sure this is where we're supposed to go. Yeah, we are in level 3, and level 4 is where we find the Palace of Malice. Alright, we want to turn left up here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, jeez. We gotta get this guy's attention. It looks like this guy can walk across the electricity. A visor kaiser. I feel like we've already fought these things before. Either way, I definitely want to beat this guy down. Rab's getting pepped up. Oh, we have we have solar flare access right now. Ooh, nobody wants to fight us now. Please don't resist dark. Oh, well, that's fine. Cause who should finish him off? All we really need is main character and Serena. Serena has Kabuff, Oomphal, and Healing Magic. And then Loan can do all the damage. Alright, boom. Now I can walk across these electrical floors. To the land of Bogers. What are these dancing dudes? Token takers as well. Alright, we're just gonna blow it. Let's see how much damage we can do. I like how we get this skill for absolutely free, just by completing the story. You don't need to do anything special to be able to reduce their lightning resistance. I'm just going to attack. They have lowered electric resistance, but we don't have electric moves on anybody but Lone. Alright, we knocked them both out. There we go. We didn't even need to use electric moves. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. Alright, smoothly dodge those guys. Charge! Oh, what is this? They're like running a casino over here. Oh, this one's actually a token taker. Of course the one that's not occupied is the monster. No one wants to... Oh no, he made Rab goofy. What are we trying to do? We're trying to oomph up loan so we can knock this boy out in one hit. We're probably going to gain a um a level soon, so I'm gonna start knocking these boys out. It's time to start doing some damage. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. He's not dead? How? These things are fat. Oh, he's still not dead. Oh, he's rolling the dice. Hold on, let me see this. What did he do? What luck, a restorative rain. Okay, I thanks, I guess. Now you're definitely gone. Kaboom. Serena gained a level and learned a new spell. What did we learn? Thwack! Uh, you know what's better than guillotine? Guillotine on every single monster. We gained 18 skill points. I'm pretty sure that still can't get us what we're going for. Because we're going for this, which costs 65, and this also costs 65. We're probably going to get this before we get this. 65 for a thing. Wow, that's crazy. 800 casino tokens for absolutely free. Whoa! Oh, well, I guess we're going to fight this guy instead. Ha! Ha! Avoid this that other monster by fighting this guy instead. Rab! Oh, what a goon. Of course, it's always Rab who gets begoiled by the gold smell. Don't attack me. I'm your grandson. He stole my MP. What did he roll? Oh, what does that do? I'm hit with a deadly curse, but he missed. Alright, let's go swoosh him again. Alright, let's finish him off. Just a couple more swings, right? Bang. Oh, I guess not. Stop! I need that MP! 
Oh, he's still alive. Come on, Rab. Nice and crit. Let's go, Serena. Thank goodness. They give a lot of gold. Are you kidding me? All of them but one have been a token taker. All right, he's rolling the he's rolling the slots. What does he pull? He just pulled restorative rain. Why would you even use that move? I wish it would restore my MP because Rab took it all when he was begoiled. Bang. I'm just going to start using good crack. Like Zam was just so weak. Rab just needs to get one level so he can learn. So he can learn Zamel. Hopefully he wins Zamel at 49. I already did that one. This guy's. Man, I'll beat you up. That's my slot machine. Wow, that was so much damage. Oh, he's dead. Oh, what? He lived. My critical hit didn't even Oko him. Alright, these guys are getting tough, I guess. We did it, darlings. Nice. He just hit the 200 coin jackpot. Alright, you gotta get beat up too. You're taking my machine! This is my lucky machine! Sylvander... Sylvander's getting pepped up. That means it's time to actually start doing damage. Wow, big damage. Not even 100. Come on, Sylvander. All right, this should knock him out. Yeah, see see how Serena can actually get the knockout? But Sylvander can't. Hmm, Sylvander, come on. A thousand tokens. Oh, we just ruined that guy's day. He actually... He actually... Oh, shoot. These guys can run on the electricity. Ah! Yeah, that guy had just won the thousand coin jackpot. And we killed him and took his prize. Nah, you gotta go. Oh, come on. How are you not dead yet? Did I do all right? Serena is the most pure and innocent. Oh, we're just gonna run away. Hey, well, I'm not. Uh, look at me, I'm a bad guy. Well, I guess he didn't fall for it. He didn't fall for it at all. Alright, let's just do a lot of damage. We've got our pet power ready. So we can instantly just drop that for his whiz. Do the Demoglios. Knock that guy out before he can do anything. Oh, new spell lord, please be Kazam. Thwack. Oh, hey, that, that's fine. Hey, you know what? Give me that multi-hitting one-hit KO move. Jade now has 15. What did we want on Jade? One of these? That costs 16. That costs 14. That costs 18. And that costs 18. So I guess we're going to get this. Sexy beam. For mature audiences only. Actually, don't we? No, that's a claw's ability. That's a spear's ability. And I suppose all this stuff down here, yeah. Is stuff that's not fisticuffs or um, allure. So, Rab only has 10, and we need 13 for the next one, I think. So, I think we need from that. These guys are getting excited. Aw, oh, you'll never catch me. I'm too quick. Look at that. Got that mini metal. Cop that mini metal. Very important for story progression. There's this guy hiding in the corner. Oh, is this the flexing room? Is this the gym? 
I bet you Jerkulees say bro all the time. They're like, bro, I want to go get a protein shake, bro. Can you keep my weight set held until I get back, bro? That's that's how Jerkulees probably talk. What's over here? Oh. It looks like you can actually drop. But it looks like I've already been there. And gotten that. Alright, who's this goon? Oh, it's a golden statue. Shade shifter. They don't do that much damage, do they? A great keeper. That only did 92. We got a oomphal up loan. I have a feeling Kakrak is going to either knock out these shade shifters or do a lot of damage, yeah. And then Kaswoosh is probably going to hit this guy really hard. Ah, oh, 135, that's good damage. Okay, that did a good chunk. Not gonna lie, but we're gonna blow our last Umbridal Blade. We're out of MP now, but we knock out the Great Keeper in one shot. Lone Ranger gains a level and 8 skill points. That gives him 12 skill points altogether. I really don't think we can get anything with 12. That costs 16, that costs 14, that costs 14, that costs 14. I might save up to get uh, this pep up. It costs 25 MP. And instantly peps up my entire party. Which sounds really, really good. I think I actually might save up for that. Looks like there's nobody else here. They're going to step on the warp panel. And go right up here. I'm going to heal up because we were getting a little low. Not really, though. Oh, we did gain a level, so now we can use more Unbridled Blades. That's nice. Nothing right there. Where does this lead? There's a Great Keeper who tried to step on me. But I was too quick. I got the gold bar and I dip. So let's fall down here, I guess. Or these ugly boys. There's multiple. Oh, what do you mean they get to attack first? Oh, yes. They get to attack and do. Ooh, ooh okay, okay, okay. No, hella chopped around the Hooper Troopers. Bang, bang. I should just use Thwack. <laughs> but I'm not going to because I'd rather just actually beat these guys right now. Everyone knows Kazam but Grandpa. Very sad. Alright, let's finish these guys off. Right, that guy's a lucky guy because we're going to skip him. Step on the warp panel. Warp over here. Hey, that's my treasure chest. Oh my gosh, this guy is just flexing. Oh no, he got me. And Serena. Hey, Serena, avert your eyes. I'm the only guy you need. You don't need to pay attention to that guy. Alright, let's uh, sobering slap. Lone. Bow. I'm going to make sure my attacks do lots of damage. Oh, never mind, I guess, because we just missed. LOL. Oh, Serena got pepped up before she went and swung at Sylvando. 
But we can still bring Slaps Arena now. Alright, we're taking some damage. It's time to start doing some damage. But first, we're gonna multi heal. That pretty much brings everybody to full. Bang. Ouch. No. Ah, I, I was gotten again. Oh, that does so much damage. Bang. Oh, I hit lone. Too. <laughs> Oops. Alright, we're gonna have to multi heal again then. Nice and blocked. Let's go. Alright, he's getting low. I think we can start swinging. Finish him off. Oh, not quite. But this will do it for sure. Bang. Let's go. Man, I really just couldn't help it, but... Admire those... That flexing prowess. Another... Recipe book. Liquid metal swords. Liquid metal great swords. Liquid metal goomerangs. Liquid metal spears. Liquid metal shields, liquid metal helms, and liquid metal jackets, and liquid metal armor. So we do, ha we already have like liquid metal. Hmm. I don't know if any of that's going to help, but I'll definitely go check as soon as we. Get to where we need to go. Alright, I'm skipping these guys. Because I can probably make at least a liquid metal great sword and maybe even a liquid metal sword for Sylvando. Ah, you can't get me. I don't know why I'm climbing this. There's nothing over here. Thought there might be. That's a. Why are there big hands? All right, time to fight. All right, the whole squad is here. Oh, what's that gonna do? Oh, damage. Okay. All right, one. Time to get strong. Ouch. Alright, let's helicopter these hella riders. Bang, bang. Big damage. Wow, so strong. Stop attacking Rab. There's time for my attack. Bang. Just knocked them all out with one attack. That's the power of our grandpa. He's super strong. I'm gonna heal up. Because we were super low. Looks like we just climb. Where did this lead? Yeah, went right through their toes. Fifty thousand gold. So hey, if we can't forge some new stuff, we can buy the stuff we need to forge it, hopefully. And if we can't buy the stuff we need to forge it, that's unfortunate. Oh, it's a dark doulahan. Or no, I don't, what is this thing? A headless hunter. Yeah, the dark doulahans are the ones that aren't on horses. No, he... Decrease my magical might. But we're going to attack regular and we missed. Oh, she de he decreased Serena's magical might. He blinded Sylvando. Alright, but we don't miss. Ever. 
We never miss. Ow. Good B. Oh, wow. Well, I really thought that would get him. Oh, we missed. Oh, man. Come on. Don't crit me. That's not cool. This will knock him out. Wow, it didn't actually knock him out. Ah, nice and critical hit. There's some justice. I don't really think we needed that critical hit, but it's nice to get. We took some damage from that. Hey, right, you'll never catch me. Alright, I want the initial swing on this golden dragon. He looks tough. A great dragon. This is why it's called Dragon Quest, because you got monsters like this. But, of course... Ooh. Okay. Oh, look at that. Now we're all pepped up. Look what we can use. Completely heal all allies. But... Instead, we're just going to use Unbridled Bleed. Bang! For a nice 800 points of damage. We can now use Kasush to do even more. Well, never mind, because he resists wind. Ha 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 ha. Does he resist dark? No, he's weak to dark, it looks like. Is he weak to fire? Nope, he definitely resists fire. I'm just going to knock him out. We have this ability for a reason. Bang. He just fell on me. I can't believe you would do such a thing. Alright, we've got some exploring to do. Oh, look, it's another Nocturnus enemy. That's where we need to go, but we can't reach there. Alright, Nocturnus. How is that knock Nocturnus? Hello? Ha! Blocked. Alright, we've still got Solar Flare. Let's go. Who wants some? I hope you guys do. Bow. It's time to do some major damaglios. That just knocked out the Headless Hunters instantly. What is this thing even called? A loss leader. Okay. He, I'm almost certain he resists dark. Look at him. He definitely looks like he resists dark. Doesn't resist ice, though. This should finish him off, hopefully. Nope, because he resists fire. Yeah, I need a new sword. Oh, nice encountered. To knock him out. Let's go. Main character. Hey, he need a level. Now he's level 12. Hendrick grew to level 50. But he only has 10. So Eric can definitely... We can go to this and unlock this. To unlock this Guile skill, which is Falcon Slash. Ooh, that's good. Then we can unlock this. To unlock this Knife skill. Which is an increased dodge chance. And then, yeah, we have 10, but our next thing costs 16. Alright, let's break this final, uh... Thing of Crystals. That's all of them. Wow, that's not even a mountable one. 
You only want to fight the mountable ones. Ow. Oh, he paralyzed us. Oh, now he's doing a lot of damage. Alright, let's... Multi-heal with Rab. Not quite as effective as with Serena, but we need to tingle with Serena. Nah, I'm just going to attack. These things aren't that tough. They're not tough enough to justify. Oh, he's going for it again. Get out of here, dude. Gross. Can't believe you would actually go for that paralysis chance. Bow, swing, finish this guy off. Nice. We need to go over here. Nice, an A-gate of evolution. That's what I like to see. Is there anything higher? Nope, you just can't fly higher. Definitely. Oh, never mind. All right, now this guy wants to go. Oh, we're taking a lot of damage. We're gonna need to heal up. Oh, come on. All right, that's it. Let's just knock him out. This will knock him out, right? Nope, cause he dodged. Ha ha, lovely. Fun, dodge this. Two hundred and fifty-four. That did a lot. Let's finish him off with a kaswoosh. There we go. We did it, darlings. Right, we want to go this way. We want to heal up first, though. There's a big hole that we can't cross. I think it's not an enemy, right? That is one gross looking statue. It's just a lost leader. Standing here in the back. Looking at the wall. Pondering why he's even doing anything. Because the main character is just going to skip me and not fight me. So watch the point. Well, the point is to look cool. Okay. There's nothing up here. Except for this treasure. A poker. What is that? Isn't that a spear? Yeah, it's a spear. No, I wanna look at it. 100... It cannot be blocked or parried either. That's a pretty good spear if I was using spears. What's over here? It looks like a button. Press that button. No, I didn't do anything. Don't fight me. I'm innocent, I tell you. I am a good noodle, I swear. Alright, 
looks like we gotta go this way first. I mean, isn't it nice that the Lord of Shadows sometimes leaves just free stuff sitting on the floor? Fortunately, I haven't seen free stuff sitting on the floor in a while. There's a great dragon guarding this super important treasure chest. More recipes? A stardust sword. Ooh. That is really good. That can lower the defense of any struck. Okay, yeah, let's equip that. I don't want the flame blade. Hello? I hate running into the people who resist fire and then I do less damage for no reason. Wow, hold on. There's still more to explore. That's what it looks like. Before we can actually get to the Palace of Malice. And before we even go to the Palace of Malice, we've got some stuff to craft. This is a long dungeon, isn't it? Makes sense, though. They want you to believe that this is the final dungeon. Even though I know it's not, lol. You ain't fooling anybody. Alright, they've got the whole squad here. Everyone's pretty healthy. Let's go. Ow. Alright, let's do him full upload. going to c crack with Serena. Bang. Good damage. Ooh, okay. That's fine. Ooh, that did a good chunk, but that's fine. We're gonna unbridle braid this great dragon. Bang! 700 damage. Ooh, we're taking a good chunk. Oh, I only cast this because I thought the dark, the headless hunters would go down. Maybe I sh shouldn't have done that. Oh no, he got us. Alright, uh, Unbridled Blade will for sure knock out this great dragon, right? Well, no, it did not. Oh, but you know what will? We have Dragon Slash and a new, a new sword. This will for sure. Never mind, that did nothing. What? Oh. Oh. Alright, we can't miss a crack, right? Please tell me you can't miss spells. Let's finish these guys off. Didn't finish them off. Cause Swish will do it though, right? Nope, it will not. Just finish this guy off. Seven damage. Oh, we have minus one attack, though. Zamel, I know for a fact, does a lot. Whew, that was tough. Savando gains all that back. Now, 14. What can we get with 14? That costs 12. That costs 16. We'll probably get this, then. That's really cheap. Increased pep chance, that's really nice. We can just blow off Riz Wizzes. What's next? This costs 20, that costs 18, that costs 20, that costs 18, that costs 20, and this costs 16. So we'll probably get Miracle Slash next then. You get a free Dragon Hide.
press. Alright, that'll send us to the Palace of Malice. But, the other way will get us into the secret room at the bottom. Look at those statues. That's so disturbing. Alright, bet. I'm running right through their feet. There's no way they'll catch me. Well, they caught me. That's fine. They're in a group. Oh, crap. We are so low. I forgot to heal. I'm going to more heal on Serena. Oh, thank goodness it's on Sil Silvando. Just kidding. It's on to Lone and now Lone's dead. Oh, I thought it was on to Silvando. Because Silvando was at full, so he could have lived. Alright. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to Zing Stick Lone. And we're going to multi-heal. Bring everyone right back to full. Pretty much. Oh! That did a lot of damage. Wow. I should have Oomfold Lone now that I think about it. We also got to he uh like restore our MP cuz we are out of MP with Serena which is not good. Ow. All right, let's oomphle up on Could crack. Hopefully this will maybe possibly put them in a Yeah, there that's how we restore MP around here. Are they in range? Oh yeah, because we just crit. And now you're dead to this attack. Alright, let me in. Alright, there. I'm going to magic and cast evac so we can get right back to the bottom. And we healed up, so that's great. I'm gonna sneak past these guys. Let's find out. Oh my. Oh, I. Oh, crap. I didn't realize that. Breaking those crystals cause gems to fall that we can pick up. So we got a nice pull right there. You'll never catch me. Alright, let's go. Let's see what secrets this room was hiding. A meteorite bracer. Doesn't that increase your agility by like a hundred? Yeah, so you get a hundred agility from it. That's honestly really good, except for the fact that the... I, we could give it to Sylvando instead of the Titan Belt. 
We get the 264 agility, but we lose a little bit of attack and a little bit of defense. That's fine, honestly. I'm okay with that. Alright, good items. Now we have to zoom back to the this place to see if we can forge any of that good new stuff. We've got a bunch of new re recipes. Oopsies. No, I don't want to talk to the statue. I want to set up camp. Alright, first I want to sell my old stuff. No, I don't want to buy. I want to sell. I don't suppose we have anything. Yeah, I didn't think so. So we can 100% sell this fire blade. <laughs> you can't sell the sword of light. Unfortunate. I mean, it's not like I'm ever going to equip it. We can definitely sell this maca bray mantle. And we can definitely sell this titan belt. Boom. That's all we want to sell. Now we have 100,000 gold. There we go. We get to level up with our forge. Increase our focus by one. That's fine. A liquid metal sword does not help Sylvando because we got his new sword. But I'm one. Yeah, I know a liquid metal Guru sword wouldn't help Lone, but if we get it to plus three, it will. But we need more lamp lights. That's honestly probably not too difficult. I'm going to see where I can get lamp lights then. And then we also learned how to make a boomerang and a heavy spear, but we don't need that. We also learned how to make liquid metal shields, which helps Serena, honestly. But we use up our Denisium. Densinium. We could easily get some more. Hey, Rude Foxy, what's poppin'? Um, the thing is, we'd lose our magical might and magical mending that the shield gives us. For more defense. Eh, I'm actually kind of okay with that. And of course, there's the liquid metal helms, which two people already have equipped. There's the liquid metal jackets, which doesn't actually help anybody. That's an evasion thing. The liquid metal armor, which we already have two people equipped with. And there's no liquid. So yeah, it's basically the liquid metal sword, a uh, great sword for loan, and the shield for. Uh, yeah, the shield for Serena. Man, if only we had another brain drainer. Building new stuff for VGC19 sounds fun. I haven't played VGC19 since since my PC like weeks ago. And I've got a PC this Saturday. That's going to be my second event of the season. So should be fun. I'm going to go in like with absolutely no practice. All right, I'm going to start by getting that shield. Liquid Metal Shield. I really do actually want this for uh, Serena. We're going to unfortunately lose our Magical Might and Magical Mending, but that's fine, I think. Nice and critical. Alright, let's go. Ooh, almost. Alright, how many double whammies can we use? Only one? Crap. We could use a triple whammy as well. Yeah, that's going to be our last hit. But it's still going to be pretty good. I think this is plus two. Brainstorm together. Um, I'm trying to... Oh, what? A failure? Oh, it doesn't look like it turned out very well. How much does it cost to rework that? 18. That's pretty expensive. 
Oh, we didn't get any perfectionist pearls from it either. Alright, I want to see where I get um, Denisium from. And those lantern things. Info. Item list. Use uh, materials. Okay, where is it? Here it is. Densinium. You can purchase it at the Champ Savage. Alright, let's go there first then. Where is the Champ Savage? Right here. I guess. I guess this is it? I hope so. Yeah, because it's, it's this Saturday and I work tomorrow and I work on Thursday. And then on Wednesday and Friday I'd like to stream. So it would have to be, I don't know, when. To be completely honest, but I'll see if I can have time. Oh, I need to talk to this guy, see if he sells Denisium. Densinium. Uh, no, he does not. Okay. Which means he's probably at the other one then. To the Champ Savage North. How far am I? I have no idea. If I'm being completely honest, it really hasn't told me how far I am through this story. I, I think I'm pretty close to the end, but I don't know how close. Um, bye. You sell Densinium, right? No, he doesn't sell Densinium. Aw, oh, big rest in peace. Then where do I buy it from? It said that's where I found it, right? Hold on. Miscellaneous. Info. Item list. Materials. The battleground? You can't buy stuff from the battleground though, can you? Maybe I just haven't reached the point where I can buy it then. It's dropped by Vicious Metal Slime Knights. View nearby monsters. I know there's vicious metal slime knights. Ah, uh, Densinium is a rare drop. Alright, how am I gonna get this Densinium? Weapons. No, what am I doing? Materials. Densinium. Robo Robins? Visor Kaisers? Maybe Visor Kaisers can do it. Yeah, this uh, has a Densinium as a common drop. Alright, what's the other thing I need? a lamp light. Oh, you can just buy them at Galopolis. That's what it looks like anyway. Alright, I'm going to try this campsite. You're not playing in many events besides Toronto. Yeah, I don't know how many events I'm going to be able to play in, to be honest. It's just that this one PC 
just so happened to be not when I was working. I mean, I do work on Saturday, but it's a super late PC, so. Yep, here's lamplight. I don't remember how many I needed, so I'm going to get two. Alright, let's go get some Densinium. Zoom, two. Ba 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 ba. Need to go to Luminary's Landing. So we can go back up there. I just want to hold on. I want to see my attributes. Agility 156, 264, 105, 116. Okay, so Sylvando should be going first most of the time. And that's good because that way Sylvando can get off the oomph on loan before loan attacks for the turn. So we should be able to get that damage increase that turn. That's why the Meteor Bracer is nice there. Sure, I'll try. I'll try to not get rusty and practice Pokemon with you. Alright, so we just got to get up to, I think it's the third store floor that had those, uh, those thingamadoo hickers. Ah, uh, dodged. I might try to re rework uh, the liquid metal shield as well. If it doesn't prove to be too difficult. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna oomph alone. I'm going to abilities. I'm just going to knock out this overkilling machine. Hopefully, this knocks it out in one hit. Bang! Nice. And now I can just easily take this weak enemy on. This swing of my staff should knock him out, yeah. Now I just gotta go up. Third story. They don't have elevators here. Looks like next, want to go in here, this store. And we definitely want to go to our lineup and put Eric out. I'm going to replace. I'm going to replace Sylvando with Eric for now, just because, uh, Sylvando, um, oh, here we go. Uh, Rab, I w it's either Sylvando or Rab, right? And Rab has, uh, healing stuff. Yeah, so we're just gonna half inch, um, the Visor Kaiser until we get that Densinium. Nice, we got it. Instant. Right, and we're just gonna start ca cracking, crack a lacking, bow, big damage, big damage. Oh, uh, he just, oh, that just healed him instantly. Wow. Okay, perfect. I am going to quadra slash because there is so many enemies right here. Bang. No, he's trying to curse me. Oh, he got me and Eric. But you didn't get Rab. So now you're going to get hit by a giant icicle. Knocked out two of them. Yeah, Eric gets to attack three times because we have two weapons. And one of them gets a free double attack. Alright, here's the next one. 
A group of enemies appeared. Wow. I should have really healed these curses first. Oh, I failed to steal anything. I'm going to Quadra Slash again. Cause these are like tough enemies, right? I need these guys taking damage. Ouch. I guess Zamo on the Valid. So I can do nothing. I wish you would learn Kazam, Grandpa. And Kaswoosh the Balib. That should finish him off, right? Nope, it did not. Ah, uh, stupid curse. Alright, there, that knocked him out. Alright, we're gonna have to defend here. Don't you have a spell that lifts a curse? Or maybe it's an ability. Yeah, benediction. We gotta uncurse Eric. Alright, give me that item. Give me that Dencinium. Oh, what failed this? Oh, nice, of course. Yes. Yeah, well, and we can't have you being cursed. Either. Now, give me that Dencinium! Oh, wow, okay. I'm gonna defend. I'm going to attack. Get some... Wow, that did no chip. Okay, we're gonna swing with him instead. That still did nothing. He's trying to curse me again. Oh, he got Serena. <laughs> he just said yoink. Oh my gosh, that was actually pretty funny. Alright, Serena defends. Oh, don't curse Rab. Oh, he got Rab. But we're getting pepped up. Let's go. Alright, I'm going to Benediction myself first. Because... Alright, I'll see you later, Foxy. I'm going to have to Benediction myself first. Because I don't want to become immobile when I try to Benediction next turn. Give me that item! Oh, where's your item? Alright, let's multi-heal real quick. And he just keeps trying to curse us, but he missed this time. Nice. Give me that item! Oh my gosh, you know what? I'm done with you, stupid head. Just drop the Dincinium, please. Who else? I didn't drop it. Now there's none left. I got tired of that. Isn't there one down here? Oh, you can actually walk on the electricity. You'll just take damage. Alright, let's see if the other guys respond. Oh, there's one. There's one. Swing. It's a whole group of Isaac Kaisers. Alright, let me hella chop to them real quick. Half inch the weakened one. Because he can't resist me. Now I'm going to swoosh. Hopefully knock them all out. Oh, one left. But one swing of this stash should knock him out. Yeah, he had one health left. He had up to six health left. Alright, now Eric. Let's get this Dencinium out of there. Let's go back to this campsite. Forge some items. We want to make a liquid metal great sword. Yeah, we only needed two. Okay, this is fine. This is actually really easy to make. Alright, think about it. Now that I look at it, those are some 
Not too difficult items to come by. Ooh, this is going to be difficult. Or maybe not. Kakwadra Bash seems to be really good on this thing. All focus cost halved. Nice. Thank goodness, I, al I almost went over on that one. Right on the nose. Focus cost increased. Wah. Oh, nice critical hit. Let's go. Ooh, that was close. Okay, now I'm going to last hit lightning bash right here. Right in the middle. <laughs> I have one point of focus left. But that looks like a good sword. Is it perfect? I did get three right on the nose and everything is in range. Oh, please be perfect. Come on, show me the perfection. Oh, it's plus two though. That's still better than what we have. Nine perfectionist pearls as well. Okay, equipment. Liquid metal great. This increases my attack by 10. All right, we can sell at least. Oh, wait, hold on. I completely forgot to equip the new shield to Serena, the new liquid metal shield. And we can give the um, the ethereal shield plus three to you. So we can sell. The metal slime shield, and we can sell the plus three metal great sword. Even though it's such a good weapon, nobody really needs that. Anything else we can sell? Uh, nothing else I want to sell. Unless we have some stuff here that I want to sell. Sell my gold bars. It doesn't look like we have anything that's the sole purpose of it is to sell it to get money, so. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. Uh, for, first, I'm going to go to my lineup and toss Sylvando back in the lineup. Second, I'm pretty sure I can get a perfect... Um, Liquid Metal Great Sword. So I really want to get that. Although it is really expensive, which kind of stinks. It takes a lot. Alright. Oh, critical right off the bat. Right there. On the nose. All focus cost halved. I could probably get away with quadra bashing right here. Okay. Focus cost increased for an increased critical hit rate. Focus cost halved. Alright, doesn't that come out brilliantly, right? Yeah, so I think if you if you rework an item that you already built, in order to get a plus three, all you gotta do is get every single one in the little nose area. So show me that plus three. There we go. Shaboom. 
You have 20 perfectionist pearls. And it costs 18 to do Serena's shield. Yeah. Ugh. I couldn't do it last time, so I'm nervous that I won't be able to do it this time, which is... I'm going to attempt it. I can always grind to do it again, but I really think... I really think I got this. Triple whammy right here. Alright, let's double whammy right here. Oh, I really hope it doesn't go over. Okay, good. Alright, we've got four bashes left. Oh my gosh. Actually, can we cook quadra bash? We can, but it'll be our last strike. We can quadra bash and then have nine left. Oh, what? Don't have my power. Yeah, what the heck? I need to not be have that power when I only have nine focus left. Oh, that's so lame. I can double whammy though. Oh, that's probably not even going to get it. I can multi bash. <laughs> Might as well. Hope for the best. Yeah. Didn't do anything. Oh, man. That's so unfortunate because I was thinking, okay, I could just double edge bash there and maybe get it, but... Yeah, it's just going to come out terrible again. Oh, man. That's really sad. All right, I'm going to grind for a little bit more Perfectionist Pearls. That was just, like, unlucky. I can make some bad items here. I can honestly just make a bunch of, like, not super fa fancy stuff and then sell it all. I could make the fizzle foil, but I'm not going to. Alright, let's see. Let me make some stuff that I haven't made before. Alright, let's make a battle fork. Oh! Double critical, wow, okay. And a lightning bash here. Well, there's a perfect one. I think getting a perfect gets you more perfectionist pearls, I hope. There you go. There we go. Plus three battle for it. Let's go. Three perfectionist pearls. Wow, that gave me nothing. Okay. We gotta get better stuff then. What does this take? Red eyes, fatal sticks, nispicious, and mithril ores. That's like really. I guess the difficulty determines how many perfectionist pearls we get. Look for stuff with high difficulty. Blood letter is two, but we only have one dragon horn. Can't make any of those. We can make lots of platinum platters because we have plenty of platinum ore. Magic shields too. That's a two star compared to how many stars was that? Did we get for? That was a one star. So it's like. I guess it's approximately one perfectionist pearl. Yeah, it's like the difficulty multiplied by the um whatever plus you got, I think maybe. I don't know. 
Those are all two. And General's jacket. Yeah, it does. And the Warrior's Princess dress. So the Warrior's Princess. Warrior Princess dress and the General jacket both. These both change your appearance. We could do this just because it's a three and a half. But it takes some really good stuff that I really don't want to use on him. Who star? This is. Oh, I'm not going to waste my stuff on that though. Silver Tiara, that's a two star. This is two and a half. And it's not too hard to make. This also isn't too hard to make and it's a two and a half. No, this is a three, actually. I'm gonna make another Pappy Unmask then. Maybe I can even get a perfect Pappy Unmask for Grandpa. Nope, I want a Kaquadra Bash. Oh, double critical. Wow, that was a lot of critical hits. I want a double whammy right here. Alright, I want to then lightning bash right here. Nice, okay, cool. Want to bash right here. Nice! Okay, and last but not least, lightning bash right here. Boom. Appraise. It says brilliantly, I think that means that's a perfect Pappy on Mask. Let's go! Let's go! Is it Papillon or Papillon? Because I always pronounce double L's Y because that's how it's pronounced in Spanish. And you don't really see that much in English. So we get eight from that. That's really good. I also want to make a scholar's cap because it doesn't take very, it doesn't take much expensive stuff, right? Like that stuff we can easily get back and we'll get a lot of perfectionist pearls. Quadra bash. Oh, critical hit. Let's go. That's a double whammy right here. Let's bash right here. Oh, don't do that. Hello? Oh, nice and critical. Right there in the middle. I could cook, 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 cold blow. And then start lightning bashing. Actually, let me appraise. Really well? Okay. Yeah, then I, I want to uh, at least... Oh, there we go. That's perfect. Yep, finish right there. That's a plus three scholars cap. There's my singing for the day. Six perfectionist pearls. That puts me at 19. So we can rework the metal shield if we want to. Um, I want to equip Rab with his new plus three Papillon mask. The Does the plus three scholar's cap even help? No, it would lit literally lower all of his stats. Does anybody on here want a plus three scholar's cap? You couldn't equip it. You can't equip it either. 
Wait, can you guys equip this old Papillon mask? That doesn't even help. I bet you can equip the Papillon mask. Yeah, that does help. But yeah, hold on. Go to items, equipment bag, the scholar's cat. Yeah, the only people who can equip it are people who have better stuff to equip it. <laughs> they either have something better that they want, that they have equipped, I think, unless Sylvando's. Now, Sylvando has a liquid metal helm, hello? Yeah, that's not helping. And I doubt it helps her either. Yeah, it would only help her magical might, and she doesn't need higher magical might. Oopsies. So you can sell the disturbing turban. Plus 30 scholars cap. Sell the battle fork. So we gained a bunch of extra money grinded so we could get some more perfectionist pearls. So we're not broke on perfectionist pearls. We got some new, yeah, we got some more money. We got some new equipment and some perfectionist pearls for later. <laughs> I'm gonna get a plus three. Well, maybe not. I don't know. I I was really hoping I could at least get a plus two, though. Very sad that I couldn't even get a plus. Couldn't even get a plus one. But hey, we've got a plus three liquid metal great sword, so. <laughs> I doubt whatever lies in the depth of this dungeon. Jasper? I'm 100% certain that this is not the end of the game, though. Because, like, A, we have not fought Jasper yet. So Jasper is going to be in there. And we're going to fight him. And then it's going to be like, but Moidegon's not here. Where is he? I don't know. And those nuggets. What are the? What's up with those nuggets? I actually, on my time exploring. Uh, well, okay. I didn't mean to go exploring. I meant to grind for equipment, right? And I ended up doing exploring because I was doing some quests, right? To grind for some equipment. And um, I found a tower. And it was covered in those little nuggets. So I'm, I know that's where we're, the story is going to be taking us. Yes, I'm going to save here just in case. Yeah, what's up with the Tower of Nuggets? Why? Yes, I want to keep playing. Oh, I don't want to save again though. We got to... Like, what's... what's <laughs> I'm gonna figure it out. We're gonna find out what's behind that tower of nuggets. I keep calling them nuggets. They they look like little nuggets though. Yeah, but of course, in order to get to the top oh the shiny spots respawn. Nice, this is wow, that's an easy way to farm for these rare crystals. Savvy sapphires and stuff. Oh, hold on. Let me pick this up first. And swing my sword first. That's a lot of enemies. That's like all the enemies down here. Wow, okay. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, let me oomphal up alone. Ow. 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 How come they're all faster than me? Ah, nice and blocked. Everyone took a little bit of chip. I can helicopter through these Dragooners. Knock them all out. Clean. He's a machine, so he's weak to wind type attacks, right? Maybe not. I don't know. What pet power can we lose? Gloom Storm. What does this do? 
Oh, okay, that's what it does. I like it. Serena grew to level 50 and learned a new spell. What does she learn? Full heal. Let's go. Oh, uh, she now has 70, and that means we can finally learn this. Can occasionally use the same spell twice for free. We've unlocked everything in Vim as well now. Dragooner dropped a dragon horn. I do want to sort my items real quick. I guess we don't need to. Now let's go to the top floor. Just riding this dragon, nothing to see here. Alright, let's uh, heal up real quick to a full enough HP to where we can take on whatever um, lurks in the Palace of Malice. Oh, here's the four, the four sages Alexis, so you can, I'm gonna max heal all then. Oh, it used Hendrix MP instead of ours, so there we go. That means we I'm not going to waste uh, these Sage's Elixirs. I'm going to keep them on loan. I should really give them to... Uh... Oh, hold on. Yeah, okay. Yeah, items then. I'm going to transfer... I'm going to transfer them to Sylvando. Because Sylvando... I'd rather have loan doing damage, so I'd rather take Sylvando's uh, turn to heal MP then. I just had him on Lone Ranger because they default went to his pockets. Alright, I don't know what to do with the Yggdras will do though. I'll just keep it on Lone, because Lone's the only one who doesn't have a, a spell or ability that completely he that heals every single party member, because Sylvando has Hustle Dance, and then the other two guys have Multi-Heal. Alright, here we go. Palace of Malice. Alright, Jasper. Serena's so nervous. Nobody else is, though. Huh? It's Veronica. Oh, this is for sure a trap. Veronica? It, is it really you? Oh, this is a super trap. S Serena? No. <laughs> You're both here. Oh, thank heavens. I feel so lonely in this horrible there's no way. There's no way, right? Here, can I ask you something? Can I ask you to die? Yup, it's definitely a trap. You'll do that for me, won't you? I mean, I had to die and you didn't. Uh, that can't be fair, can it? So come on, what do you say? I say no. Will you die for me or not? I wanted to live, but because of you, I couldn't. So let's even things up. Come on, drop dead. Oh, do we have to fight Veronica? No! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, time to find it. Please, foul phantom, dark intrusion. Light dispel this black illusion. All right, who is this really? I never have said such awful things. Go <laughs> off with you. 
Is it Jasper? Oops. Oh, she just disappeared. She it was nobody. A thing. I know she didn't. She died with hope in her heart. Hope that we would bring back the light. Um, <clears throat> this is your doing. I sense it. Jasper, show yourself. Yeah, Jasper, come on. Quit being a a little wiener. You speak of hope? Of light? Even now, with one of your little band beyond saving? Your faith is sickening. Alright. There he is. Finally, we get to knock this guy's socks off. I hope he's wearing socks. Seeking an audience with my master, I suppose. Well, I'm afraid I shall have to disappoint you. Let me guess, you're the final spectral scent now. But we both know you are too pig headed to listen. And besides, I would not want your journey to have been in vain. All right, fight me, boy. What's he doing? Oh, he's transforming into what? There's the silver orb embedded in his chest. Have you though? Alright, it's time to fight. Jasper Unbound. This man really thinks he's the toughest. What does that do? A lot of damage? Okay. How many times does he get to attack? No, don't call for backup. Get your goons out of here. Alright, let's just multi heal. Man, Grandpa, I really wish you knew Zamo right now. Alright. I don't know how often he's going to call for backup. I'm just going to attack the Balib then. Just knock him out one hit. One hit or quitter. What do we know? We know Kasap. Uh, I'm not going to Kasap when I can regular Sap. We're going to do so much damage per hit. Yeah, good. say goodbye to your defense. He's probably a demon. So I doubt that's gonna do much. I could tap dance, ha 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 ha. I could also accelerate. I could also set a remore heal. I'm gonna accelerate. <gasps> no, I accelerated! Ah! Oops, ha <laughs> ha. Oh, but I. Okay, well now Lone is super fast. Okay, he decided to skip his turn. Big mistake, my boy. Let me show you 8,000 bajillion damage. All right. Um, I don't know. You know Kabuff. I, I guess I'll just use that. We really don't need to. Uh... I hope this helps. Ah, ha, ha. Immediate gratification, double Kabuff instantly. Oh, that's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. What if I just tried to whack him? But no, I'm going to play it smart and go for the actual attack. Alright, Rap, do some damage. Bow! Alright, let's actually accelerate this time. Get everybody's speed up. Alright, it's time to do a lot. Bow! Bang! 
928. Oh, he crit me. Get your butt out of here. What? You can't just crit me. And he's getting pepped up already. No, my stats. It's fine, though. I can just multi-heal here. He still has no defense, so... So now what? I guess... Look how low he... He's already at half. Oh, he might be a double stage then. If he's already at half. Alright, let me oomphal up loan. Oh, you think you're so cool, don't you? No! What did he do? He made me hallucinate. Oh, I'm getting pepped up now. Oh, let me immediately chop and churn. For 439 damage, instant gratification. Alright, we're going to more heal up loan. Because we need him to be not completely dead right now. Yeah, he's so low. Setting up your main character to just unleash these... Extremely powerful attacks. Oh, he has regular defense now. Lame. Oh, you shouldn't have skipped that turn, boy. You shouldn't have skipped that turn, boy. We're going to multi-heal here. Get everyone healthy. Hey, I never miss! Bow! I, I missed that time, though. Darn. All right, hey, you don't, you don't need that defense. Oh, I don't feel bad about... Oh, I missed again. Do we have an ability that... Uh, we don't have it on him, at the very least. Unless it's... No, we don't. Darn, fine. I'll just attack. No, she knocked Serena off her feet. Oh, no more power of pet for you, boy. Alright, let's see if we can connect this time. Ha <laughs> no. ha! Alright, you know what? Let's just start attacking. You're too low to justify not just going for a crack. Serena has fallen and can't get up. Alright, let's accelerate. Let's speed up. Nope, that's a lot of damage. Okay. He's really trying to pull out all the stops. Alright, here's his backup. Here's his goon. Let me multi-heal right quick. I don't even need to knock out your battle. I'm knocking you out. Uh, never mind. Uh -huh. Ooh, Rab's getting pepped. Rab's getting pepped. I'm gonna oomph low and renew that attack boost. Man, I am super blinded right now. Oh, that did a lot. That didn't do a lot. Okay, you know what? I'm just landing this attack. Oh, I can't hit an attack to save my life! Alright, let's multi heal again. Oh, can we use that? Yeah, let's use Gloomstorm then. Hello? This don't miss! Oh, he's done. But the Balib's still there. The Balib's like, hey, this battle's not over. <laughs> we gained a lot of experience and a good amount of gold, too. Oh, we gained a lot of skill points, too. Oh, Rab doesn't learn Kazam? Come on. Jade grew to level 50 as well. Eric grew to level 51. Eric is super strong now. <laughs> so is Hendrik. Alright. He has 22. That can definitely get us something. I just don't know what. Oh, right. We're saving up for pep up. So we actually don't want to use that yet. Eric has 11. This costs 18. That costs 14. That costs, and those probably both cost 16. Yeah, so you can't get anything. You have that. 
Our next thing, like these both cost like 18, yeah, and this costs 16. Yep, so we want that next. Rab can definitely get one of these things. Up here. We're gonna increase our magical might. Yeah, this requires you to unlock this and this. So this is surely gonna be super powerful. This as well. Hopefully, it better be. And then Hendrik can learn something up here at Heroism. You can learn double up, right? Unless we want to go for those first. Nah, I'm going to learn double up first. Pep up, power up. Increase the bonuses of order for being pepped up. Nice. Yeah, so we need to get this and this, which is really cheap, in order to get that for heroism. And then for this, uh, right, this shield skill, we need to unlock this and this, which is a little more expensive. That's, I might go for those next, just so I can get those out of the way. All right, you've got a second form. Oh, he doesn't have a second form? Okay. Alright, show me that second form. Again, you surpass me. Again, you outdo me. Again, you you leave me behind. The more you bathe in glory. The more brightly you shone, the more I receded into shadow. Do you know what it was that I always wanted? He's probably going to say something super cheesy. I was like, to be your friend. I wanted to be like you. Of course. get the silver orb back. Goodbye, Jasper. Alright. Papow. Alright, let me uh, quickly sort my important items. Alright, that fight wasn't too hard until he blinded Lone and we couldn't hit a move to save our life, but we still managed to get by. Hey, Nick Styles, thanks for the host, dude. Alright, what is this? Alright, Hendrik, what do you got to tell me? That'll lead us to Mortigan, probably. Which I already know it's not the final battle because of those nuggets have had no story up to this point. Mordigan. At last the time has come to face him. There's no way this is the final boss, right? Oh no fair. Let me go. Who's that? Who caught all my friends? Jasper and the rest of the Spectral Sentinels. They're all alive. <laughs> Did you think me beaten? Did you think you had trusted me? Oh what, is he like the king of puppets? And he was using a puppet? I bet you that's it, and these are all like puppets of his. He controls puppets. These are his puppets. <laughs> oh, Hendrik, your face. Now you will see who has left who behind. You want to fight? By all means, go to face my master with me. But know that you will do so well. 
Your friends here will be staying with us. Okay. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. I'll do it. You really think I'm not man enough? Stop laughing. No. He shall not go alone. Oh, is this where he resolve breaks him free? I am the luminary sword. His shield. His unswerving companion. We all are. We're in this together. If we face Mordigan, we face him as one. Aye. If you think I'm missing my chance to get revenge for my Eleanor after all these years, you've another thing coming. Don't worry, darling. I'm with you all the way. We're going to bring smiles and sunshine back to the world if it's the last thing we do. Yes, I promised Veronica I would finish this. And that's a promise I mean to keep. You heard. We're in this together. I'm not leaving anyone to suffer alone ever again. Hey, yo, I don't need, I don't need help though, guys. Don't worry about it. Man, these guys are super strong, too. I can just break themselves free at will. Break his puppet strings. Oh, and he just instantly dies again. What? Heartfelt moment. Heartfelt moment between old friends. Now enemies. No, I cannot die yet. I have yet to surpass you. You, you speak of surpassing me. Of course, something super cheesy. You were the one who spurred me on, the light that guided me. Without you, I would never have become myself. How is it that you never knew? Hendrik, I. I. No, nope, it's too late. A goner. No more puppeting, puppeteering for him. Guess another one of those shield pendants. Rest in peace, Jasper. It is time. Mordigan must pay. Except there's no way this game is over. Unless it is. Like, I'd be so surprised if those little nuggets get no story. And it's just like, oh yeah, the star was falling. But nobody cares. Because <laughs> I definitely care that that star was falling and he just broke it for no reason. Like, for supposedly no reason. Like, why did he need to break the star again? We did, we did get another... Right? Oh, it's... No. We didn't gain, unless it's in Hendrix's pockets, no. We don't get another token of fealty. Darn. This will transport me to the Palace of Malice. Fortress of Fear, in the Palace of Malice. No secret hidden treasures of super coolness. Okay. No free stuff either. Maybe we don't even fight him in here. It's possible. I think there's going to be some sort of fight. Right? But I don't know if it's going to be the final fight. 
I really don't think it's going to be the final fight. Because I really want to know what those nuggets are all about. Well, what if I beat you up? Would you still reign supreme? I want to find that out. Hey. Squad, pull up. Hey. You want to back that up? You're talking all that good stuff, but I want to see you show me just how good you are. Yeah, yeah. he is pretty ugly. Not if I beat you up first. The Lord of Shadows draws near. Oh, what am I doing going first? I'm not blowing a quadra slash yet, am I? What am I doing? I don't know. Poof. Ha ha ha. Snooze. No. I have no idea. I, like, I was supposed to not be... I'm, I'll just attack. <laughs> what else was I supposed to do? I'm not going to waste MP when I'm not super strong with an oomphal under my belt. Alright, he's super slow. Hopefully he uses physical attacks, because I'm kabuffing. Let me double up. Oh, darn. Let me uh, take away your defense, too. Oh, I missed. A cut above. Oh, that does a lot of damage. Oh, lovely. Fantastic. No, that's fantastic. Yes. I mean, I can oomphle at the beginning of every turn. So that's not like the worst thing in the world. But I would have preferred to keep my stats. I also can't really kabuff because I definitely have to multi heal here. Nice, I got a double. <gasps> I got a free secondary one, let's go. All right, what are you doing? I'm gonna try to sap again because you can't get you can't get the defense back if we get rid of it. But stop! Oh, he created another one. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Well, okay, yes. No, that's fantastic. Yes. What if I confused his shadow? Aw, uh, they can't be confused. Uh, shadow of Shadows. I really can't let this thing just keep going. Like, that thing's super dangerous. I, I, I think I can get away with, um, Kabuff. Here. Maybe I can get a secondary Kabuff. Let's go! Serena really doing the 
work. I love it. I love it. I love it. And yeah, here we can crack. This should knock out the shadow of shadows. And get some chip on big boy over here. Oh, that does a lot. Oh, he's draining my MP. But it do not matter. Because we are going to... Uh... <laughs> Evasion rated up. No, I'm not. I guess I'm just going to chip him. 80 damage per hit? That's fine. This is where the big damage comes out, though. Bow! 764. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, let's try to sap again. Oh, I missed again. I actually have... Hmm. I might need to try that. Yes, you definitely want to multi-heal. <laughs> I got a, another free multi-heal, although I don't need it. The ultimate power, what does that do? Oh, halves my HP. In that case, I'm gonna more heal him up. Or more heal. Not more heal, re more heal. That way I can just blow a mid heal on him. They're gonna heal like 150 too, not just 100. <laughs> yeah, now we're basically at full. Bang! Boom! 782. We have an ability, right? These are spells, right. Caster Sugar. This makes... Yeah, I think I want a Caster Sugar. Magical Might and Magical Mending are increased. Oh yeah, he has Kazam, but I don't. Not white, no! Wait, never mind. That was a damage dealing one. I should... <laughs> uh, I should really not stop doing that. I'm just going to oomphal Sylvando so he can do a little bit more damage. <laughs> I should really take this battle seriously. I'm doing a lot of damage, but... I'm going to... Um, mid heal myself because I have the um extra magical mending so this should put him into range where multi heal gets him to full yeah ow that did a good chunk and I'm at plus two hey you gotta take some more damage 143 let's go there's some chip all right time to buff again we're running out of attack we're running out of defense Oh, Lone is running out of attack. He no longer has attack. No. That's fine. What pet powers do we have? Only Chop and Churn? Um. Alright, I'll Chop and Churn this time so I can oomphal him next time. Bow 182. Let's go. Big damage. All right, we've got increased magical might. You know what that means? You know what that means? <gasps> Good crack! Bow 221 damage. Kachinka clang. No. He turned me into gold. No. Oh, he hit Rab for big damage. Alright, we can just more heal that off. Oh, we're getting papped, boy. It is time, boy. Oh, we can't Gloomstorm because Lone is stuck. <laughs> As a statue. Bang! Alright, we did good damage. Oh, he summoned the Crimson Mist. Sylvando's a mass of solid gold. We're losing our remor heal soon. I'm just gonna hit him up for more damage, I guess. Like, why not? That does so much damage. Holy moly. Well, 
Let's see if we can sap him. If we can hit get this off, that'll be really good. Oh, we missed again. Oh, let's go! Second chance. Oh, he resists it really well. We're losing our magical mending on him. But hey, we can Gloomstorm now. Yeah, you can take some more damage too, okay? 134, let's go. I actually could have... Oh, an Icy Blade. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, this is gonna do nothing. Yum! Oh, it's time, people. I want this. I need my... I need my Oomful back. Oh, it's time. It's time. Oh, wait. Hold on. <laughs> Alright, let's heal up. I might as well. I guess. Like, why not? I lose my Remore heal, but... It's okay. We're doing 800 damage in attack. Oh, and we still have Magical Mending buff. Bang! Oh, it's so over. Hey, he does a lot of damage. The red mist cleared. Oh, that's why he was doing a lot of damage. Savannah's getting pepped up. Oh, we got Frizzwiz? Let's go. Let's Frizzwiz it up. A firestorm. Let's go. Lord of Shadows. More like Lord of Nothing. Okay, that was a bad joke. I, it sounded better in my head. I, I was, I almost had that one. All right, I'll, I'll have. After I beat his second form, I'll definitely have a better joke to make. This is the power of the luminary. Impressive. Uh, I mean, what did you expect? But I tired of these games. Oh, you tired of these games? Of course. It's time for him to show his true form, right? So what is he going to do? Is he going to transform here? Oh, he's destroying his own temple. There's no way we're going to fight while he destroys his own temple. Oh, he transformed? Into what? What does he look like now? Oh, he's got a long tail. A giant skeleton dragon. Oh no, that's the end of his tail. You just disintegrated your own flesh. And he has two heads. The Lord of Shadows and Mordegon. So he's got two parts of him that we have to fight. So Mordegon is the dragon. And Rab is dead. Who's this? Sylvando's up. Okay. How much can we move around? Okay. We're gonna spells, we're gonna oomphal up long. We can only fight Mordegun right now. Lord of Shadows is in the back. I guess we're gonna hit him up. He, he, for some reason, decided to restore all our... Oh, yeah, keep laughing. Yo, I dare you to keep laughing. Hey, Rab, you don't need to be dead. A blazing fire. Uh, it's good damage, not gonna lie. All right, let's accelerate, because these guys are actually pretty fast.
I hope these guys don't know Kazing. Alright, since he knows Blazing Breath, I'm definitely insulotling. Because I do not want him. Oh yeah, just stand in the back and cast a crack. Yum, look at that pathetic damage. That's right, I called your damage pathetic. What are you going to do? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, you're not going to catch me. Oh, he lowered my spell resistance significantly and then cast Kafriz. Ooh, okay. That actually didn't do as much as I expected it. Hey, you want to keep doing that? I dare you to. <laughs> keep your casting spells on loan. Who, who's this? Oh, it's okay. Uh, I'm going to multi-heal here. Hey, more damage. Bow. No! Oh, it only gets rid of my good stuff. Alright, Lord of Shadows jumps into the fray. So he can laugh and not actually make an attack. Oh, no, he casts Kaboom. Oh, that's not good. Oh, nice, Grandpa. Let's go. Reflect that spell. That's what I like to see. Alright, we're going to oomph alone back up. All right, yeah, keep keep wasting your turns. I dare you to. You want to take some damage too? All right, let's go. Bow. Um, we're gonna cast bounce. Where's bounce? Here it is. Oh wait, this is this is Serena. Serena's gonna cast multi heal, not bounce. Hey, let's get a free multi-heal, too. Let's get everyone up to full. Oh, darn. Okay, that's fine. Yes, you're going to cast Bounce on loan. Ooh, that did a good chunk. Not going to lie. All right, let's accelerate now. Ho, ho. What the, ta, 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 ta. Let's go first. Yeah, keep casting Kerfriz from the back. You'll never catch me. Ha, he caught me. Shablam! Boom! No, my stat buffs! Alright. He's putting the dragon half back in. Oh, no. They're both in now. Oh, now we're pepped up. Now you're donezo. Yeah, done though. Bow bow. Wa cha cha. Ya ya. Ha ha. Ah ya. Alright, we always cast balance on loan until our. Oh, please be on loan. Aw, oh, don't do it on Sylvando. Who is this? Sylvando? Alright. Alright, loan. Let's get that attack pumping. Let's get that blood rushing. Whoa. He ate. He ate Sylvando. Ah, oh, you spit him out right now. Oh, what if this hurts Sylvando because he's in there? Oh, it didn't. Okay, good. I was actually super nervous. All right, let's uh, let's cast Bounce as well. Eh, I could kabuff, but honestly, I think I want to bounce. Rab has a bouncing. Rab already has a. Semi bounce in his armor, so I'm gonna cast bounce on Serena. Can I cuss at? <laughs> I'm not that real. I'm just gonna crack. I'm gonna get some damage off. Bow. Oh, he's getting focused. What is he pepping himself? Oh, he pepped his whole buddy system up. Oh, I'm envenomated and. Okay. That's fine. I can easily heal that off. Alright, Mortagon. You're getting low. Oh, he did he just cast that on Grandpa? No, he cast it on Sylvando. 
Oh, Savando's done. Alright, we can, of course, kissing him right back. So that's not too big of a deal. Alright, let's get everybody back to full. Hey, that sounds like a good idea. We've got two healers on this team, boys. Two healers! Oh, they call upon the power of... What just happened? Oh, they summoned a sigil. Alright, you know what that means. You want to do damage? Let's heal it right back up. We got the on sigil. On who? On so Why do they always attack Sylvando? That's what I don't understand, though. <laughs> Sylvando, no matter what the monster is, Sylvando is the target of attack. Oh, you may have hit me. But I heal it right back. I heal it right back. Yo. Yeah. Bow. Oof. What we got? Alright, he's getting super low. I'm gonna crack. Shablam! Alright, they restore their MP. Yo, you should have restored your PP. Alright, lower my spell resistance. It do not matter. That's fine. Because again, I got the anti. Hey, Serena. Yo, next. Ah, that's fine. Mortagon's in the red. Yo, he's in the red. Oh, he is dead. Did I, remember when I said he's in the red? He's in the dead, is what I meant to say. Alright, let me multi-heal back up. Alright, that was better than the... That comeback was better than the... That's really all you can manage to do. Oh, he killed Grab. Crap. Alright, it's not the end of the world, though. Especially because that thing's done, so... We need to renew Lone Ranger's attack. The sigil disappears. Shabow! We got Kazing! Yo! Yo! Oh, he calls for his bolts from the blue. Hey, that's Rab Stick. Hey, it's time to dance. It's time to dance, boys. Yo, you know what? Let's cast their sugar. I need to become more powerful. I wasn't powerful enough before. Now I need to become more powerful. Yo! Yeah. Alright, Rab. Let's get you back up. Almost at full. Oh, he knocked Rab down. I just got his special attack up, dude. Alright, you know what? Let's hustle dance. It's time to dance, boys. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. All right, we've got one more unbridled blade. Bow. That just does that does too much, honestly. What abilities do we have on her? An attack that can deal heavy damage to demons. Enables a party member to avoid instant death attacks. Protect from status ailments. Protect from. We can protect from any element of attack. Brings into barrier that protects the user from offensive spells. This weakens his spell resistance. This gradually restores my MP. And this increases my... I'm gonna... I might just attack with Serena if I'm being completely honest. Let me recover 5 MP. <laughs> oh yeah, go ahead. Restore yourself. 
Oh, now it's getting... It's looking grim. Boom. 500 damage. Oh, man. He was not ready for Frizz Wiz. Oh, no. He is so not ready for this. Alright, if Rab gets pepped up, it's super over. Come on, Rab. Get yourself pepped up. Dang it. Alright. Let's make use of this, uh... Increase magical might. Bow. 28 damage. Okay. Kaboom. More like a nothing. Yum. Uh, let's hustle dance again. Yah, yah, yah. My attack power returned to normal. That's fine. I'm just going to attack. Oh, he's done. Wow, we didn't even have to cast a uh, solar flare. I was going to solar flare him, but if Rab got pepped up, but it looks like we don't even need to. That was too easy. We acquired the Sword of Shadows. Was that really it? Did we really smack this guy? Oh, he... He really doesn't look like he's gonna make it. I don't, I don't think he's getting back up, guys. I think it's over. Dang, we really beat him. It's over. Mysterious voice reverberates around the room. You have done well to defeat Mordigan. Thanks to you, life and light will return to Erdria at last. Uh, who was that? It's Erdwin. Yup, let's go. Oh, did they really make us leave? Oh, no, it's a cutscene. Okay. It's one of those fancy high def cutscenes. Oh, no. That's not good. Alright, don't worry, guys. Our whale is here. Jump on! Catch a ride. Man, we actually just destroyed his entire castle. I probably... C What is it? Yup. The tree is being restored. All the leaves are back. All the life has been restored. Shabloom. Oh, does it just magically start floating again? Houston, we have lift off. Boom. And we got the star remembrance. The end. Question mark? No, I doubt a question mark is going to appear. But we all know that's not really the end. 
The Lord of Shadows is defeated and peace returns to the world. But does it though? I mean, that one nugget was purple. A few days later, Lone Ranger and his companions gather in Arborea to remember their friend Veronica. Oh, this is where Veronica comes back for sure. She's going to be like, hey, what are you guys mourning about? And I'll be, we're going to be like, uh, hello? <laughs> oh, welcome back. We knew you weren't dead. Thanks for coming back, I guess. Oh, what if she, what if when she comes back, she's like super powerful? Oh, I might have to. I, I, I'll only put her on the team. Yep, yep, of course. Back here. Post game time. Here's what's happened so far. Our heroes survive a blistering battle to topple the Lord of Shadows at long, long last. Free from Mordegon's Malin influence, the World Tree begins to return to life. And as its healing powers pour out over Airdrie, light and love bring the land alive once more. Their quest complete. There's nothing left for the companions to do now but to return home. Oh, Grandpa. That's where you're wrong. I saw that nugget try to bring that star into a uh, Galopolis, and we're gonna find out what that's all about. I refuse. Okay, this is what we saw before. I refuse to believe that there's nothing going on between these nuggets. Alright, we all have our goblets. Filled with orange juice, because this is a... Oh, we have... <laughs> orange juice because we don't drink out here. This is a PG channel. She gives one to her. Look, Veronica. Everyone's here to see you. We've come to celebrate with you. The world's at peace at long last. One thing that I do want to say, although it just started, I am glad that this doesn't... Like, one of the things in the past is that in Dragon Quest games, um, most of the time after you beat the game, it would put you at a position right before you beat the final boss, right? And there would be no post-game story. So I'm glad that this one is... There's like a continuation of this story. And rather... And instead of just putting you right before you fought Mordegon. And Yggdrasil's in full bloom again. I am it's happy about so that. Beautiful. It still hasn't sunk in, you know? We really did it. <laughs> we really saved the world. Oh, for sure. It was easy peasy. Mordigan plunged Erdria into darkness. So many lost their lives. But we survived. We have to make the most of that. We have to laugh and smile for those who can't. We may feel like crying. Goodness knows I do. But we mustn't. <laughs> I can only imagine what Veronica would say. Ah, uh, she's gonna pop up and say something. Watch. Pull yourselves together. You've saved the world, you idiots. What are you blubbering? Yeah, that's exactly that's exactly what she would say. That's exactly why we kicked her off the team. <laughs> Excuse my awful impression. <laughs> she's too sassy. <laughs> Oh, who's this? We were wondering where the guests of honor were. The festivities have already begun. It's party time. Come on, darling. Let's go let our hair down. Our hair is already let down. Nobody's wearing a hairband out here. Well, except for uh, Serena. All right. Oh, never mind. More cutscene. I, th I was going to say, it's time to actually do post-game stuff. But no, still got a cutscene up a little bit. Looks like peace has even loosened up the Arboreans. Then what are we waiting for? Let's make this a party to remember. <laughs> there we go. Achievement unlocked. Awarded for defeating the Lord of Shadows and restoring the world tree to its rightful place in the sky. Immediately goes to the item shop. <laughs> I, I just want to see if they sell new stuff. Oh, no, I don't want to buy that. Nope, no new stuff sold at the shops. I really hope that's a continuing trend. I really don't want to um 
have to check every shop for new stuff. All right, let's partay. Right, okay. <laughs> no, I haven't. Oh, wait, equipment bag. Sword of Shadows. Alright, I guess I'll try equipping it. Why does it increase my attack? What? It has so much attack. 196? Calls forth a devastatingly dark and destructive force to strike a single enemy when used as an item in battle. Oh, and it's a great sword? Ooh, I might have to have this a clip. Uh, I guess I'm a bad guy now. Oh, wow. Okay, that's that's a nice sword. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. Hey, right, what's going on up here? All right, one another thing is now, now that I have the Sword of Shadows, I guess I don't need the... The Sword of Shadows is literally more powerful than my plus three. My plus three liquid metal goo rate sword. That is crazy. That's 190. I can always make another one if I need to. Which is why I'm okay with selling it. Yeah, I guess I'm Mortigan now, guys. Alright, sorry. Gotta destroy the world. It's such an ugly sword, though. <laughs> it's so strong. Oh my gosh, yes. I like it. Alright, let's go. Alright, Serena's up here. Alright, what's going on? Alright. I dig it. All right, what's going on, Jade? <laughs> Want to try the different cakes in Gondolia too? All right, yeah, I'll take, I'll try the cakes too. That sounds pretty tasty. Alright, the party is going in full swing. Let me go up here. Oh, what? You won't let me go? Okay. Oh, well, then I don't know what to do then. Then leave Arborea to see the world you saved. Alright, let's go. Oh, before we go. Think you're going? Uh, there's story stuff. Remember that? You, Eric, you were the one who pointed out the glowing spot. Okay, yes, of course. <laughs> of course we can. Now the world is at peace. The fun can really begin. If you're looking for new adventures, I know where we can start. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, thank you, Eric. That's exactly where we're headed. I mean, I can't imagine where else we would want to be headed. I mean, there's a couple places. Actually, now that you think about it, I want to look at the quest catalog. Oh, no new quests unlocked. How many quests do we have left to complete? We've got one, two, three, four, five. Five more quests to complete. Oh, there's a... Uh... There's story points in the, all those places. I'm going to Octagonia first, though. There's Octagonia. Yeah, those little... Exclamation points means there's story stuff to do at like every major location. All right, we're definitely streaming the post game. <laughs> this game is too much fun. I 
Alright, give me my horse. Did new enemies pop up too? Doesn't look like it. I mean, that's fair. It's not like after you beat the game in other Dragon Quest games. Oh, well, look at that. The world is now infested with even stronger enemies. Ha 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 ha. Alright, move it or lose it. We don't share the road. I see that little pink, uh, thing I'm gonna do, Hicker. Alright, oh. Alright, what's going on? Story time! Yeah, what is this place and where did it come from? Was this one of those, like, watchers? Islands that fell from the sky? Well, now. This place looks a might familiar. Aye. It's these funny wee buildings. I've seen them before. Yeah, weren't they like the watchers? Yes, there's no mistaking it. It looks uh, just like I knew the floating it. island where we met the watcher, doesn't it? Let's go and take a closer look. Who knows? We might find something interesting. Everyone's just investigating anything in here? Yeah, grandpa's in here. Don't worry, guys. I know exactly what to do. Go to the middle, because that's where the thing is. Oh, Serena's looking at something. What's going on here? Of course Serena finds, these, finds the important thing, because she's the smartest. It really draws you in, doesn't it? Oh, are we going to get sucked into a painting again? Yep, those little nuggets. Those are definitely nuggets. Oh, what what did you find? Reminds me of something. Ah, of course. I've been reading a book they say was written by the Watchers of late. Let me see if I can find the right part. Spirits of lost time. Beings born from the land. Beings who control time. What? Spirits of lost time. Could they be these figures in the painting? Wait, are those what the nuggets are? The spirits of lost time? According to the book, they guard the sacred light that controls the flow of time. What? Okay, that doesn't that make any sense. bright enough. Even those who are lost to eternity can be restored. Oh, are we going to bring Veronica back to life? Restore how exactly? <laughs> you mean like Oh, that's where the story comes in. It's time to bring Veronica back to life. Wait, if that was true, then maybe... Well, just maybe... Huh? Think about it. We lost someone to eternity, <laughs> didn't we? Someone we'd love to see again. Well, maybe we wouldn't love to see her again, but uh, I guess we have to get her back, don't we? Veronica. <laughs> They all took so much time to figure it out. It's like, we did? Who could possibly have we lost? Like, I don't remember anybody. Like, that's me too. It's like, we lost somebody? I don't remember. Hey, let's leave because we don't have anybody we need to restore. Who needs to bring Veronica back? She was annoying anyway. Do you really think we could? <laughs> oh, but I guess it would make... If it would make Serena happy, then we have to do it for sure. What else does it say about this life? Light lives in Tower's heart. Sacred tower. Tower of lost time. Ooh. Watchers guard wheel of time. Key to tower. Key to time. Key brings spirits. <laughs> Sets wheels, wheels in motion. motion. So if we had the wheel of time, we might... We might really be able to... Oh, I wonder what that thing the Nugget was looking at. It couldn't be the Wheel of Time. What have we got to lose? If there's even a chance, we have to try, right? <laughs> Alright, let's go. Eric's right. No matter how unlikely it is, if it might be our chance to see her again, we simply have to try. Let's go. But Hurry up. The watchers are all gone, right? 
So, how do we find this weird thingy? Oh, where could it possibly be? This was once one of the islands, wasn't it? And I'd say that hole in the wall up there was pretty real like. <laughs> oh, what? Hold up. Okay, that's where we got to put the wheel of time, I, I guess. We could do worse than start our search right here, you know. There's a way through up there. Let's hey, don't let Eric have all the good ideas. And what was There's a dragon right there. I can see a dragon that was like broken out of the uh, Right, that broken part? There was a dragon right there, wasn't there? Do we have to fight a dragon? Right, let's go. I wonder where it could be. Oh, hey, look, a Nefarial Stone. Yep, I've been here before. I collected that stuff. I wonder what this could be. I acquired the Wheel of Time. Oh, boy. Story progression. <laughs> Thanks, so dude. I understood that book correctly. The wheel will bring the spirits of lost time to the tower they mentioned. But where might this tower be found? No likely candidates spring to mind. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, follow the nuggets. I can just see every single nugget. Come on, guys. You got an idea where the place we're looking for might be? Follow the nuggets. I thought of something. There's an old tower north of Yggdrasil I always wondered about. Unless anyone's got any better ideas, what say we climb aboard our <laughs> way and see what we can see up there? Hey, dude, you're just saying what I'm thinking, okay? I had these ideas first. All right, one second. That's an important item for sure. Let me sort that real quick. We also got this. I don't know what this is. It seems important. But I don't know what it is or what it does. Or why we got it. But first, we got the Wheel of Time. Why not see what it does? Let's put it right here. Oh, I can't put it right there? Oh, darn. All right, I'm, I'm just gonna zoom, I guess, to... Oh, all the pink things disappeared. Okay, I guess uh, all the pink things led here. Where am I going? I need to go to the Luminary's Landing so I can take off on my whale. Cause I can't just, unfortunately in this game, you can't just take off from your whale anywhere. And you can't just land anywhere either. Unfort. It's not that big of a deal, but it makes travel just take a little bit longer. I can't believe I have the Sword of Shadows on my back right now. Like, what is going on? Yep, let's go. I can't believe Veronica actually died. I thought she was just going to pop up. But no, we actually have to bring her back to life. Crazy. Alright, luckily I know exactly where the tower is. Because I went here while looking for a... Uh, while grinding for equipment. <laughs> I got a recipe book. That, that I, This is where I got the uh, recipe book for the staff that Grandpa is equipped with. And you're about to see just how many little of those. Just how many of those little nuggets are here. Look at this. They're like an infestation. There's so many. And nobody else can see them but me. Crazy. Alright, let's open this place up. Oh, 
Oh, you thought this game was over? No. We've got another dungeon like right here. The right tower. I wonder if these spirits have lost time are here already. Huh. Come on, laddie. I wonder. I mean, they're not just climbing the tower right now. Oh, who's behind us? Oh, is it more nuggets? Oh, it's the purple nugget. Oh, is the purple nugget evil? Is that like the evil nugget? Is that why he's purple? Because all the other ones are white, right? I just assumed he was purple because, um... Yeah, I just assumed he was purple because, uh... The Urgeman's Lantern was so close, and the Urgeman's Lantern makes them appear purple. But no, that one's always purple. Alright, lots of... I have no idea what's going on here, honestly. Alright, what do I do here? Oh, this is basically a warp panel. Where are you taking me? Long. Now let's find some good stuff. Alright, so I guess orange takes us to orange. Blue takes us to blue? I don't know. I just want to find the treasure, okay? I don't want to accidentally trigger a cutscene. We're just going straight up. Clonk. Do we have to, like, get up there? Okay, this is... A confusing dungeon. Haha, -ha, lol. I'm, like, just going forward. Oh, there's treasure! No! Stop! No, go back! Oh, wait, this takes us to treasure anyway. Alright, okay, okay, I'll take it. I'll take it, for sure. An A-Gate of Evolution, yes! Dude, we're gonna get so much good stuff. We've got so many A-Gates of Evolution now. Alright, that's a giant hourglass, I just realized. Ha ta ta ta. This is very interesting music. I don't know what to think about it, to be honest. Just gonna drop and connect. Flunk. Oh, whoa, I didn't even recognize this. You can just find Chrono Crystal sitting on the ground in here. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, this one's next, I guess. Alright, where are we going? Where is this? I need to look at the map. Okay, there's only one way to go. But there is the treasure down here. Could never miss treasure. A hero's book of basic weapons. Nebula swords, darting daggers, asterangs, shining staffs, straight pokers, gringham whips, dragon lord claws, and maxi axes. I've... Actually, before... I want to see if I can craft any of that stuff. That stuff sounds good. I want to see if I can craft it. Alright, I can always come right back. Actually, can I zoom to the... Can I zoom to the Tower of Lost Time? No, I can't. LOL. Or maybe I can. If I can, it's lost on the map and I don't know where it is. Either way... I can always just fly back pretty easily. I learned Crosscutter Blow. 
lands a swift pair of strong strikes across two diagonal squares. Alright, so they were all weapons. We can actually make a Nebula Sword because it takes the Stardust Sword that is already equipped to... <laughs> to Sylvando. Isn't this the best sword in the game? And it takes one Agate of Evolution, one Lucida Shard, and one Even Cloth. I might make this. Actually, I think I will make it. That's really good. Uh, yeah, I mean, the only way this could go bad is if I mess up and it doesn't pop out right. Alright, what is this uh, cross cutter blow? We can't even go to the top square. So we're not using that. I think triple whammies are the best way to do this. I could sizzly puff first and then start triple whammying. Don't do that! No! Oh, I don't need... Ah, oh, crap. Oh, jeez. Can we even... Oh, no, we didn't even get close. It's just, ah, I don't like when it does that. It keeps, okay, these are hard to make. <laughs> All right, this was not a very good sword. It's going to be poop. Failure. I successfully forged a nebula sword, but it doesn't look like it turned out very well. No perfectionist pearls. Oh, uh, I didn't actually get a new recipe for a great, great sword. Okay. This is the next. It needs a deft dagger. Nobody carries not a uh, boomerang. Uh, a wand. That what? Okay, we didn't actually get a wand recipe either. A shining staff. We need a bright staff and a bright rock. Where do we get a bright staff? I don't know, but we don't have it. It would be nice if we did. We could make the straight poker because we have the poker. Mega Gringham Whip. I know where to get the Gringham Whip. It's not a bad item, but we can't get that yet. Yeah, so these, I think these are the best weapons in the game. We actually have the bad axe. So we could make this if we got some den densinium. But I'm not going to do that quite yet. I wonder how much it cost to rework. Oops. Okay. Where is it? He's got it equipped. The Nebula Sword. Oh, I can't rework it? Uh-oh. That's kind of not good. I didn't know I couldn't rework it. I think I can tear it apart though, some way. All right, one second. Sorry guys. Uh, pfft. If I do this. Most recent save was in the Heliodor region. Oh yeah. Like, I'm sorry guys, this is kind of cheap. I didn't know you couldn't rework it though. I, do, I don't want to like, <laughs> waste the materials. This is like right before we went camping. Alright. Getting caught up, I, you guys probably know this. While taking a tour around the world, they brought back the brink from the brink, Lone Ranger and his friends stumble upon an ancient book, seemingly 
seemingly written by the Watchers. They learn of a tower that houses a sacred light with the power to return that which has been lost and begin to wonder if that power might be used to bring Veronica back from the beyond. They soon find the Wheel of Time, which acts as a sort of key and set out to search for the tower itself. They eventually arrive at the tower, which is swarming with spirits of lost time. The wheel fits, the door swings open, and the friends make their way inside. Alright, so yeah, I know that's kind of cheat to reset when you don't get the sword as well as you wanted it. I know that in, uh, before, right? Yeah, I know that before is, hold on, okay, he is equipped with the bad axe, actually. So we have the bet. We have the f original form of the best axe in the game, and the original form of the best sword in the game. And his shield is the original form of the best shield in the game as well. But basically, um, in Dragon Quest IX, you just throw. You can forge uh, a strong weapon like that, one of the forms of the best weapons in the game, and uh, a certain item that, which I'm sure we're going to get at the. Um, I'm sure you can get them at the uh, one place, at the Tower of Lost Time. And you can reset items like that and then try again for a better one. But I just didn't want to waste the <laughs> materials because I didn't know. And I'd rather try when I actually have a chance of um, making it plus one or two or even three i think if you get it plus three it might just not even i think what might happen is if you get plus three it doesn't even show as plus three it just becomes because i know this uh nebula sword isn't like the best sword from dragon quest nine sorry i'm just talking to you guys with all the dragon quest lore right super boring right but yeah basically the nebula sword is like one of the best swords in the game but the best sword in the game which is technically a better version of the nebula sword um it's not called the nebula sword so i won't be surprised if you when you forge one of the best items in the game <laughs> And get it at plus three. It doesn't even say. Hold on. What's this over here? Oh, that's Mount Angry Law. Sorry. Getting distracted. Hold on. What's that? Oh, that's the battleground. Keep getting distracted. I need to fly over here. Look, it's the sun. Hooray. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if when you forge a plus three or a perfect version of it, it doesn't actually call it Nebula Sword plus three. It calls it like a. Whatever the best, the name of the best sword in the game is. Look, a sparkly spot. Hooray. Technicolor Dream Cloth. That's a good item. But yeah, and as you could see, the A Gates of Evolution are what you need to create the best items in the game. There's probably more recipe books in here for the best stuff in the game. Or maybe not. I don't know. There's definitely more recipe books to get. That's probably some of the post-game stuff that I won't put you guys through. But I'll, I'll probably do that kind of... Because it's probably like you have to grind for recipe books. And I can easily do that, but I won't I won't make you guys watch me grind for recipe books. Alright, we got to take the blue one. Yeah, and I mean, another th cool thing is that rarefied monsters, at least the Leviathan things, have a chance to drop A Gates of Evolution. So, I'm never in a spot where I will run out of A Gates of Evolution and can no longer make some of the best stuff in the game. It's sad, though, that there's no best... Alright, we're going up. There's no best um, greatsword. Oh, that's a really big nugget. Oh, he's huge. I am the time keeper. The flow of time. Of destiny. I watch over them. What are you? I am 
just what I say, and that is all I am. It's just a timekeeper. There's no other way to describe it. I hope you don't mind us intruding, but we heard there might be a rather special light here in the tower that could, well, that could bring people back. We've lost someone very special, you see, and, well, we were hoping you might be able to help us. You speak of time sphere. I guess that's what we speak of. If you were to harness its power, that which you seek might be attained. But to lose time is to lose much. The path you propose to follow is not one to be trodden lightly. So what's... Oh, we all have to give up a little bit of our lives to restore hers. That is some crazy stuff you're talking about. If your companion is to be restored to you, time itself must be destroyed. What? As I say, to lose time is to lose much. So in order to save Veronica, we would need to turn back time. Do we have to go through that entire second half of the game again just to get Veronica back? That would be crazy, but on the luminary. Oh gosh. But like But you say it's possible. That doesn't mean it's going to happen. But it must be done. I would gladly give up all that has happened since that day for the chance to change it. Alas, to lose time is to lose much. Only one of you may return to that place. Oh no. The power of the luminary. In this world, only one such power exists. Yup. That of the luminary. So I have to go back alone. I know you. I knew you the moment you appeared. Only you can break. Oh, do I have to reset everything and lose all my stuff? That would be unfortunate. When the memories are shattered, you will return to the past, and there you will stay. You mean he'll have to live it all again? He can't come back here to us? 
To lose time is to lose much. This world, this reality, these will be lost to you. And that is not all. The outcome of the sphere's shattering is impossible to foresee. Oh no, don't say stuff like that. You're making me have second thoughts. That's awful. Your present, your companions, your life even, all these may be lost to you. Knowing this, are you willing to risk all for the sake of your departed? Am I? Just for Veronica? I don't know. I mean, there's not much to do. Like, this is the only leg of story that can continue as with the post game. You can't go that way. What are you doing? Oh, so you don't want to save Veronica. Okay. Wait, but that purple nugget is coming. He was at the door. Alright, purple nugget, come on. He's going to come up there and we're going to have to fight him. Can we even walk past him? What's going on? You guys like me too much, don't you? But when I try to leave, I'm gonna get nuggeted. Alright, nugget, show your face. Wait, what's going on? It just says, speak to them and make them see how serious you are. I was about to leave. Yeah, they disappeared. Oh, I can get past them now. Nope, too late. Yes. We have to save Veronica because there's literally no nothing else to do besides grind. Okay, okay. You win. We know you well enough by now not to try and talk you out of this. But you better not mess this up. You go back there and you save her, you hear? Save us all. Oh Fasho. This will al this will also restore Heliodor, so we can actually go there and do stuff in Heliodor again. But somebody will, and that's the purple nugget. Do I get to keep my equipment? Your memories, the record of your adventures thus far. <laughs> your knowledge of battle. So I get to keep my skills. I hope this applies to everybody and not just me.
Oh, can I shove my friends in them? So I can just shove my friends in them and they'll be okay. Let's let's go. When you shatter the sphere, all that you possess will be placed within them. Thus, may the items you require journey with you. Why can't I put my friends in them though? That's fine. I don't use regular swords and I can't equip it to Sylvando. But you should retain possession. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's okay with me. I'll take it. That's a good sword. This will surely prove to be a more than worthy weapon for the time being. <laughs> I'm gonna go in there, I'm gonna swing once and Mordigan's gonna die. <laughs> So we get to keep our equipment, at the very least, and I'm hoping that everybody gets to keep their experience and not just me. Because if I have to go back and everyone's like level 25 back then, there's no going back. I mean, <laughs> if I save in a different spot, there's going back. Okay, yeah. Are you absolutely certain? I mean... There's nothing else to do besides grind for equipment. This is how you continue the story. And get, unlock... Unlock the cool stuff. Like the ultimate key. I never got the ultimate key. Wait. Yes, guys, hop into the capsules. Stand ready to pledge myself to your cause once more. To be your sword, your shield, your unswerving companion. <laughs> Something's gonna happen. Yes, yes, very dramatic, Hendrik. <laughs> now, if you've quite finished frowning and swearing oaths, farewell, darling. I look forward to seeing you in the past. <laughs> I know you can do this. I know you won't let anything stand in your way. It's getting super emotional. <laughs> like anybody's lo we're only He'll have a few words to say before you go. Yeah. What's he got to say? You've grown into a fine figure of a man, laddie. But don't look down now. We'll only be apart a wee while. We're back there waiting for you after all. I just want to beat Mordegon up again. Wait, what about that purple nugget? He's going to mess something up. Oh, no. Oh, we got to fight this purple nugget. Oh, she's sad. She... Don't worry. Green's got something to say to me. What does she have to say? But it became so much more than that. <sighs> Gasp. Never forget the time we spent together. This is why Serena's bay. So please. If you don't mind, I hope you'll take me along with you. All over again. Yes, of course. I mean you are the healer after all, so no matter what, you were gonna have to come along. Alright, Eric, your turn. Wait, I guess Eric doesn't want to say anything. Okay. Alright, Purple Nugget, let's fight. Why is the Purple Nugget so evil? Is he evil? I don't even know. Like, we still don't have enough explanation about all this stuff. And why was he bringing down Erdwin's Lantern? Oh my gosh, we're going to go back to when the Erdwin's Lantern wasn't broken, guys. That Purple Nugget is getting his Lantern back, and I don't know what he's trying to do with it. Oh, there's probably so much more posed game than I originally thought. What if the what if he absorbs the power of the lantern and becomes a giant monster? That's that's what's gonna happen. Oh, that purple nugget. He's gonna he's gonna like turn into Nocturnus. Oh my gosh, I have <laughs> this is crazy. I don't know what's going on. I'm just kinda making stuff up. I hope you guys don't believe every word I say, but what if that's what happened? 
The purple nugget is Nocturnus, and he was trying to get his body back. All right. Let's save Veronica. Wow, I broke the freaking sword instead. But I cracked the sphere. It's time to go back. What do you have to say? Say it now. This isn't goodbye. Not by a long shot. Well, no derp. Of course I'll see you again. Where do you think I'm going? I'm not going into the future where you're all see dead. Yup. Alright, Mordegon. <laughs> There's the purple nugget. Oh, what if it sends us back too far? And we go back all the way to the beginning of our journey. On accident. Going right up to the right point. And that's where we're starting off. Oh, I'm asleep. I'm asleep. Hi, hey, where did everybody go? All right, we made it to the past. And there's my sword of shadows. <laughs> oh, wait, what if everybody else is already up there? Oh, crap, I got to hurry then. Yes, but just in case, I'm going to actually save this in spot two. So I don't accidentally throw away everything and then realize, oh crap, I did lose a lot of stuff. Oh, nobody's in my party. Oh, they're probably already up at the World Tree. Is there going to be a second me up there? What if that's what the purple... The purple thing is. That was me. That was me from this point in time. But when I came back into the past, I was erased and replaced with the me from the future. And that purple guy is me. And we have to fight the evil me who's mad that we trapped him in the corner. And he's trapped in the... Yeah, that's probably it. That purple guy is one of the... Is trapped in one of the farthest corners of time. And he's mad. He's like, I gotta get myself out of here. Alright, I'm here. Oh, don't tell me you already sent them off. Serenica, blessed ancestor. The time has come at last for us to fulfill our destiny. What are you doing? Where is everybody else? We're going to use the orbs to take the luminary up to the world tree, and he's going to awaken the power that would banish the dark. Yes, yes, I know that. <laughs> Stop talking. I'm here. So we don't know what's up there waiting for us. Oh, yes, we do. <laughs> Quit talking. But no matter what happens, I swear I won't let the luminary come to harm. Relax. Look at my sword. She's going to look around. She's going to look and say, why is your sword so big? <laughs> why does it look like that? He's our light and our hope. And he'll rid our world of darkness. I know he will. Serenica, sage 
of legend, lend me your power. Help me fulfill my duty and protect the luminaries. Why don't we find any trap boxes as well? We need to find a trap box. Those probably give two seeds of skill. That's a bot. That's a blast from Dragon Quest VIII, though. So I don't know. It's a very interesting looking. Of course I was. I have ears. <laughs> hey, this is my sword. This sword has like 196 attack. Okay, that's more attack than you have with an item equipped. <laughs> oh, did she really do this in the past? Oh, what's gonna happen when Mordegon sees my sword? He's gonna be like, wait, isn't that my sword? And I'm gonna be like, nah, this is my sword. Goodbye, I'm gonna chop his hand up. I'm gonna make him hurt. Oh, there's everybody else. Yes, okay. Let me equip your stuff. <laughs> well, don't look so surprised to see us. We've been right here all along, you know. Yes, I know that, but like uh, what's with that sword? <laughs> <laughs> hey, for the last time this sword has a hundred and ninety six attack. Why would I equip anything else that's not that has less than a hundred and ninety six attack? Huh. Well, whatever floats your boat. Anyway, time to get this show on the road. Father Benedictus says we're to take the orbs and offer them up to the altar at the top of the mountain. Serena has her long hair back. We need to go through those doors and follow the path through the first forest, apparently. Shall we get going? Yes. Ah, not long now till we get up to the world tree at long last and finally find out how to get rid of that rotten Mordigan. Dude, I already shredded Mordegon twice over. I beat his first and second form. Let me fight his half form. His normal looking form. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I see a quest out there. Yup. New quests. These are quests that probably, like, disappeared. After we uh completed the game. Yeah, here's this thing. We got a Dracillian shilling. We never finished that. We accepted it at the beginning of the game. And never finished it. So I'm going to actually go accept that quest right now. Because, uh, why not? What do you want from the old man? Super soup. We get a butterfly baton for helping him make super soup. Alright, we just need... Okay, we might not actually get anything <laughs> done today. Alright, hold on. Does everybody already have their... They have their equipment from all the way back then. But luckily, <laughs> we have our. Oh, what if they did they go back in skill too? They're all the way back at level thirty. No. So I guess Eric can't equip. Yep, he can't equip that stuff. All right, we're gonna give you the really powerful um, Gladius. I don't even remember what uh. Which one of these you had equipped? Was it the regular twinkling tuxedo? I know you had the rubber gloves. You also had... Not the van... What what else did you have? Oh, they're not rubber gloves. They're robber gloves. Wait, no. 
Yes. No. Yes. Why do we have all this stuff? Why do I have another... What did you have equipped? Uh... Was it the Vanguard? It might have been the Vanguard. Oh, we actually didn't save her a staff. I guess you get the Magma Staff, then. We didn't save her anything. <laughs> Oops. Red Dragon Rod. Liquid Metal Shield. Goddess Tierra. Oh, wait, hey, we got all our stuff back. We can sell it all. What uh, what did you have here? Yeah, the Papillon Pendant. Now you have two Papillon Pendants equipped. Oh, we got... Man, okay, hold on. What else did you have? Guru's Gloves. Sylvando. Hey, you want the best sword in the game? There you go. You want the best shield in the game? There you go. Uh, you wanted one of the best helmets in the game? No, wait, you don't want the platinum mail? Get rid of that crap! You want the liquid metal armor? There you go! You want the meteorite bracer? There you go! Man, it feels so good being able to equip all this good stuff, seeing all their bad stuff originally equipped. Natty Kravit plus three? There you go! Jade never had anything equipped to begin with. I don't even remember what she had equipped, to be honest. She had the liquid metal jacket, right? And then Rab had the... I know Rab had the, um... This staff. He had the plus three Papillon mask. The twinkling tuxedo plus three. The restorative. And the what? The sorcerer's ring. All right, one second. We got to change the lineup because we definitely want Sylvando here and Rab here. Yo. All right, it's time to get big on him. 130, 145, 156, 158. So I guess you had the Papillon mask. I'm pretty sure we had the dragon scale, right? Or is the titan... Is the titan belt better? It's better for attack, but not defense. I'll give you the titan belt. What else did you have? 136, 140. I'm pretty sure we had the dragon scale in the titan belt. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. Alright, now let's go sell that old crap that they had equipped with. Oh, did I get to keep my money? Yes, let's go. I put the money in the capsules. We're rich. Oh, yeah, boys. Okay. Yeah, they still sell the bad crap that I don't want to buy. Oh, we lost our... Uh... Oh, wait. It might have been... Yeah, it was just thrown into here. Okay, we want to sell... Is there anything in the item bag that we want to sell? I don't think so. Alright, let me sort this. We don't need the Zombies Bane. We definitely want that. We don't need the Sprig Drasil. We don't need the Lightning Staff. We don't need the Shiver Stick plus three. We don't need the White Shields. We do need the Ethereal Shield. Right, because we need the Bad Axe and the Ethereal Shield for the um, Hendrick. We don't need the Coral Hairpin. We don't need the Thief's Turban. We don't need the Swindler's Scarf. We don't need the Magical Hat. Oh, we, we do need to sell the other Magical Hat. Okay. We need the Hades Helm for him. We don't need the Swindler's Stole. 
We don't need the silver mail. We do need the platinum. Right? Because this gives you 6646 compared to 5141. So we don't need the princess peak coat. We don't need the princess's robe. We don't need the care riviere. We don't need the old Papillon pendant because we have the one that we... We ended up keeping the Papillon pendant the entire time. As well as the robber gloves. They... He, <laughs> Eric always had the robber gloves equipped. We don't need the gold ring. We don't need the strength ring. Yeah, he had the token of felity and the vanguard. No, the shield bearer. And we don't need the tough guy tattoo. Yeah, because we're going to give him the token of fealty, which increases his maximum HP and his charm. Yeah, I just never bothered to unequip that because it seemed, seemed appropriate. And then we have the shield bearer, which increases his parry chance, block chance. And his defense and his charm a little bit too. Alright. Is there anything else I can help you with? No. We're good. Alright. And I just want to one second. Look at the quest catalog. Have I accepted every quest I possibly can? No. There's a little girl in the grove of repose near Arborea with a big wish. And none of the other quests can be accepted. So, let me go accept that quest real quick. Because she's looking for a thing, right? That girl back here. I remember we talked to her before we went to the World Tree. And she's like, I'm looking for a flower. And so we went up to the World Tree. And then the World Tree came crashing down. And she freaking died. Wishteria. You have to track down a white bulb and defeat it in battle. Yes. Oh, we get a healer. We already have a healer, though. Alright, and that and now we've accepted all quests we possibly can. And honestly, I think, uh, next... What is it? Tom what is today? Monday? So on Wednesday is when I'm going to be streaming this game again. I might end up, or I might stream tomorrow, because what I want to do is um, grind to get all the quests done that I have already accepted. I know it's like a grind, maybe. I might grind the quests. I don't know if I want to grind the quests off screen. I think I actually want to grind them on screen. Although, I'll appropriately label the stream as such, and the VOD as such. So you know that there's I'm not going to be proceeding with the story. Oh, am I at full health as well? No. Ha! Hold on, let me rest in the inn real quick. Alright, so yeah, I think tomorrow there's a good chance that I'm going to um, do a shorter grinding stream where I attempt to get all of the quests done. Because we don't have too many to do. We have one, two, three, four. Oh wow, we only have four actually. Alright, I might actually just... I might... Hmm. I might just grind for the first part on Friday. Not Friday. Wednesday, because today is Monday, right? So on Wednesday when I stream again, I might for the first part grind and get those four quests done. I don't think they're too hard. Yeah, get some red kale. Get a wishteria. Find Zero the Shadow. You've been asked to search for a book about the two local heroes. Bookshelves in the eastern part of town for red books might be a good idea. Okay. But yes. Um, that's probably what I'll do then. For the first part of the stream on Wednesday when I stream again, 
I'll grind out those quests. Or I might just grind them out tomorrow. Because I don't know if you guys would really want to watch me grind. The thing is, since I did do some grinding yesterday and I ended up finding that tower. The tower of time. Of lost time. Like that. I feel like I don't want to leave stuff like that out of the stream. So I probably will end up trying to get the grinding in on the streams. And the fact that it's only four quests isn't that bad. So, I don't know. You might, you might, I might come back on Wednesday. Yeah, I might come back on Wednesday and you'll see me, um, having grind, having done that grinding. Just a little bit of grinding. But, if not, yeah, I'm trying to think. Because, like, I could also just do it right now. Try to do those four quests, but I, nah. I won't do it right now. I'm, I'm going to try to... <laughs> I've been drawing this on for a, a while now. I'm going to finish up the stream here. Yes, I'm going to... Save it in slot two. And yes, there's a chance that the stream on Wednesday is going to start off with me grinding. Uh, those quests. But if I do... But there's also a chance that it might just decide tomorrow, hey, I don't want you guys to have to endure me dr grinding for an hour or two trying to do those quests. Uh, so we can actually get on with the post-game story stuff that I think you guys actually want to see. But we'll see. Uh, and yeah, that's, that's it for this stream. Let me finish this up before you guys who are watching at home, or not at home. You guys are probably all watching this at home. I hope none of you guys are standing behind my chair and watching from my home. But, um, yeah, let me let me get this finished up before it gets boring. Thank you guys so much for watching. Everyone who's watching on Twitch and on YouTube, uh, it really does mean a lot to me that you guys decided to come out. And I will definitely see you guys on Wednesday for the next stream. And, I don't know, there's, all, there's the slight possibility that you see me tomorrow for a small grinding stream. So, I think that I think that honestly might be what I do. Just like an hour or two hour small grinding stream tomorrow. I think that's what I'll do. Yeah, I've decided. That's what I'll do. Tomorrow, okay, if you guys actually endured me just trying to gather my thoughts and figure out what I wanted to do, tomorrow I'm going to have a short grinding stream where I try to cut through all those quests and maybe do some more grinding of sorts. I don't know. But, yeah. Again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye for now.